Hello. How's everyone doing on this fine Thursday evening? I'm a little sleepy right now because I just ate. Um, and I'm also sick. But I'm not like violently ill, so I feel well enough to stream. I promise I'm not pushing myself. Wow, look at my wrist just break there. That was wonderful. Also, this, um, I'm playing music from Digimon World, and this song is very sleepy. It's not helping me wake up. Um, I've got, um, more Greymon to continue working on. We'll see how far I get on that today. Also, there's a little tiny gift for everybody on, um, my streaming page when I, when I get to it, uh, cause I forgot to take it off from last time, but when I saw it there, I'm um, like, you can stay, you can stay, you'll see it in a second. Here we go. He's down there. The tiny, teeny, teeny, tiny, uh, umber fool. He can stay. He's allowed. Or gentle bird sounds. Even more bird sounds. Some of these tracks are just ambiance while is this straight up just gonna be the real sounds? Yes it is. What about here? Are you kidding me? Do you know what a soundtrack is? There we go. What do I get for not listening to entire soundtracks in advance? Okay. You know, Fluffs, I could open a gift of Umber Fool in Vignon and have it sit on my head if you want. Alright, let me see if I can figure out how to do that. I know I've done it before. Inside. Always face camera. Make you smaller. Oh, you, I didn't make you smaller. I just put you behind a good man. Here. That's what happens when you're fucking huge. <laughs> I don't think I can do this. Hold on, let me switch to the one that's like comically small. Oh, oh no. Oh. Oh. 
is just Christ. Why is he not dead? facing the camera, but I want that's the thing I like to turn in with my head. <laughs> yes. It's booty. Perfectionist for the follow. You spawned as a Bumbleboy character. How about that?
there's an entire spot on here that I forgot to color in. I didn't do any shading on the color zone. Oh! Fuck, I'll fix that after I finish shading the back view. Thank you for the blur. He's just attached to the rotation of my head. He's not really on my horns, he's floating above me. See? Skype right now. Fire Skype. That's right, I haven't done this back spikes yet either. I'll have to add that.
themselves in this trap. Thought they're actually gonna fall asleep. How dare they do this to me?
the ambiance. to separate this into two different files. This is a very chunky file and saving it just now was semi-concerning.
boy. song for being the worst thing I've ever fucking heard. so bad. It's so bad. sucks. chimpanzee on the music team. Finally something decent. <laughs> and it's mostly animal sounds. I just can't win, can I?
I should probably make a note of what the Freddy's face looks like without the horn in the way, shouldn't I? That would be kind of important to know in modeling.
too easy. This soundtrack truly sucks ass. I don't know why I'm still trying to power through.
I forgot to tweet that I'm streaming. I should probably do that. Such a responsible streamer. So bad. Let me guess, is this one also obvious? Yeah, I got this one. I'll tolerate this. Very rare that most of the video game soundtrack is bad. I'm a little sick. I woke up with a pretty sore throat this morning. Um, everyone in our house has been, uh, sick one after the other. Last week, Jake was sick. This week, Ollie was sick. And now I'm starting to get sick, so I'll be sick for the next week. It's allegedly not COVID. So I, I don't know, it's probably just a weird season of cold. Thank you. It's not hit me very bad yet. Um, which is why I'm streaming, because I, I feel well enough to. I'm so... So deep into a Digimon hyperfixation. It's consuming my every waking thought. Yeah, I'll, I'll take care of myself.
We're listening to the Digimon World soundtrack, by the way. The PS1 game. I listened to a few of the Digimon World soundtracks and they were fine. I don't know why the first one sucks. There's like a handful of nice tracks like this one right now. But most of them are either ambiance noises or dog shit. I like this one a lot. I'm hoping whatever sick feeling I'm having it is just a temporary uh, side effect from the flu shot I got yesterday. Because if if I have caught whatever Jake and Ollie had, um, we might have to cancel D and D this Saturday again because it's only gonna get worse. Oh, lady, you're awesome too. Ben, you're also awesome. You guys are so cool. I love you both so much. <laughs> yes, you're with me in spirit. Right up on my head here, I can eat an old scratch. I don't know why my mono just threw an L sign and my hands were down.
more ambiance. How about that? Isn't that incredible? Why is this soundtrack like this? More. Find a different Digimon game soundtrack next. I know I've asked it before, but everybody was their favorite Digimon in the comments. If you have one. Avatars, but I might have said it to admin only. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's it's claimed by Froggins. But 
got my shoulder brace. I was supposed to have a follow-up with my surgeon yesterday about my arm surgery and its progress and whatnot. And I had some concerns to bring up. But uh, I had to cancel my appointment yesterday because I was feeling snotty. So my next appointment is allegedly Monday, unless I'm still feeling sick. My favorite Digimon is Violmon. Or Evilmon. They're the same one, just different names. Ah, ah, I see Cream. I see you, Cream. I see you, Spawned. This is me stretching my knuckles, by the way. My hand tracker doesn't know how to process this. Son of a bitch. Little freak, little creature. Nice. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm currently watching the Digimon Adventure remake with Cream. And, uh, Ogreon in the remake made me cry a little bit. I'm like, no, 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 you can't do that to me. You can't do that to me. There's quite a few points in uh, Digimon that make me cry so far. This boy is a task and a half. It's always this side view that fucks me up. At least this character is symmetrical, but I don't have to do more than one side view. I do want to edit his gun tail a bit though, I wasn't really happy with how I was sketch.
soundtrack is really something. These Wall Street is gonna be roasting the shitty tracks. This one's decent in comparison to the other ones from earlier though. That's why I haven't skipped it. It at least has a rhythm.
Thank you for the squid ones. It's time for self-care, that means for everybody. Everybody hydrate, everybody stretch, everybody bust your chin. Shake those wrists out.
you nuts. What's that? You don't need an ambulance? Pfft, I do not. Me from this nightmare. <laughs> you are picking up my suffering via bad music. easy for me. I can, uh, I can put my Sherman prop on my shoulder. Let me do that real quick. Just like when I'm done with, uh, a ritual on my head, I can put him on my shoulder. I just don't remember... Wait, 
I guess I'll just have to go re-save it. I mean, I can probably, uh... I see, that's where it is. Okay, now Sherman is inside my head. And now it's me in the live stream. Did my sound alerts break? Hold on. I'll fix Sherman in a second. I'll fix it, I'll fix it. Here, let me try. Oh, the sound also sucks. Why? Why? There we go. Why? 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 Yeah, I'm gonna start break dancing, don't mind me. Okay. I did it. I did it. It's fine now. 
encapsulates my feelings for him more accurately. God, I can't wait for this soundtrack to be over. It's not fun. It's bad. It actually, it's not good. In fact, it's terrible. There was maybe like three tracks out of this entire, entire thing that I liked. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, are you talking about that horrendous little man? I was! Did you see him? I saw him! I saw him! Oh. Wasn't he beautiful? He was, he was so stanced up! Oh my god, the little blue light blue one is everything to me. Oh, that one's really good too. Let me stick to the side a little bit. I was talking about how much the, uh, Digimon Adventure 1 soundtrack, not, not Digimon, uh, Digimon World 1 soundtrack sucks ass. Oh, yeah, it's of its time. You can't even do that excuse Pokemon existed before this thing. <laughs> it's of its time, and, like, look at the aesthetic of Digimon and tell me you expect a game with that aesthetic to have not the chunkiest music you've ever heard. Every other game has been fine. This one is not. <laughs> this one was the first one. This one was the first world one. Yeah, there's... I, I said a second ago that there's like three tracks in this so far that I actually like. Like, like, <laughs> everything else is either ambiance, mid, or genuinely bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's so much. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's Digimon World 1 for you. Everything have... right down to its mechanics are that. Oh boy. I have just a few tracks left to get through. Hmm. God, I'm waiting for it to grab something off my desk and it looks like I'm trying to give you a bug. Oh. I can't it. raise my arm to reciprocate. I, I don't even know how I got my arms to do that in the first place. <laughs> I don't know. We'll figure it out someday. Someday yeah. I'll get that really good at dance where I think I can actually give you a hug. Yeah. Let me just slide you a uh, a playlist for the songs that were added specifically into Digimon Hacker's memory. Yeah, every song on it, except for the last one on the list, um, doesn't have any vocals or doesn't have any lyrics because if there are vocals. It's just vocalization and not actual words. Yeah. I'm gonna power through the last few songs. I will give them a good old try. Do it. Just let it get to the final boss music that I've never actually heard. I don't even know if there is a final boss in that game, to be honest. Uh, the last track before, um, like the last song is called Machine Drama Battle, and that's not only one that's kind of like a name Digimon, so maybe a lot of bosses Machine Drama. That feels like it would make sense. It is! It is the last boss! Hey Green, if you want a good time, you should go to the Chit Chat. Um... Wait, hold on. Is that what it's called in my server? Yeah, you should go to the, the Tiny Chat room on Chit Chat and see all the poop like things we sent. You get one on your phone without getting into that, that call room. Okay. Oh, the the voice channel there. Yeah, the, the little miniature text chat. All right. I want you to know when we were sending those, I laughed so hard it started making me tremble, so I had to leave the game. Otherwise, I was gonna pass out. Oh. Oh, it started out strong. It started out strong with the, uh... With what I can only guess is Kabu, Terrymon, and Merrimon? Well, let me see if there's more that was added since I was last there, because uh, some people stayed in the call after I left. What is that Tai Chi one? <laughs> oh my god, yeah, there, there's a few more. Since the last time I looked. Oh yeah, there's also boobs in here. I should have warned. <laughs> there's some oh, really yeah. horny Lady Devimon figures in here. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's Lady Devimon. Oh my god. What happened to Gatomon? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Alright, fair enough, I'm not worried about it. <laughs> what? Why does Togama... <laughs> Who janked up this Cactar figurine? <laughs> I kinda wanna just, like, go through them one at a time and show them on stream, but I, I, I wanna work. You work, I'm- I'll live react to these. What the fuck? What the fuck? Else can look at them live. Yeah. Well, anybody else can also go on my server and go look at them. <laughs> That's true, if you're not already part of Bull's server, Bull's Discord server, you can get in there and get, uh cool perks like chatting to fun people and witnessing whatever the fuck is wrong with this Izzy figurine. <laughs> what? So what? So what? what? Oh 
Oh no! Oh no! These plushies! Okay, the next few ones after those are kind of cute. The the one that's like a group of six of them, they're not bad. Yeah. And when I looked up uh, Digimon Replay, I had to scroll pretty far to find hot garbage because a lot of the big stuff is fine. Yeah. I that... wanted to be fine. Yeah. All right, that one's just Deoxys. You know what's the... What the fuck is that one after Deoxys? Is that supposed to be Poochimon? Oh no. You know what? No, I can't take it. We gotta look at these on stream together. I have to show everybody. Yeah, there's like... There's some janky ones that are like, yeah, that just looks like it's a figure that, you know, a child has had for many years and it's just faded away. It's like painting and colors or whatever. And then there are others that are just... How did you build this? Oh, I I'm gonna love. Save, I'm gonna save all of the really funny ones to my phone and then upload them into a stash folder so I can just swipe through them. Hmm. Wow, I love the big slappy hands on the commentary mon one though. Yeah, if you go if you go back to a certain point it's just really good figurine. Yeah. But then after that, that's when you get to the jank. Yeah, we're gonna get there. This is so important for everybody to witness. Ooh. That Beelzemon statue though with the motorcycle it's eight hundred dollars it would be eight hundred dollars it makes me so sad I'll never have ever oh and I see that there was Mephist and Peepismon posting yeah I wanted to show some of my faves and so somebody we have said the word Peepis and I'm like did you know that there's Peepismon <laughs> <laughs> and then there's Lusamon. <laughs> and then and then Demon, aka Creepy Mon. Because that's that was amazing uh censoring localization. <laughs> There are so many better names that they could have come up with than Creepy Mon for yeah. that Digimon. Okay, I'm gonna upload all these to folder now. Alright, so I'm in. <laughs> yeah. There's. You posting stanced up Iced Evimon. That's something you didn't make. Yeah. And then there's really good figurines being posted. And then like after that, at 5.58 is uh is when it starts getting into the knockoffs hour. Yeah. No, it's enough on the home folder, you pass on the point. Yeah, I'm gonna show everybody what Yeah, also, also, high fluff, I didn't say it because I got really distracted by all the bootleg. I got distracted. The moment I saw <laughs> bootleg Izzy, I mentally couldn't process anything else, but high fluff. <laughs> oh yeah, I see what you mean about the the Lady Devimon Don Hunger Cougars. Let me put this behind. 
Yeah, I got the new idea for an anime post, but it's a new idea for a Digimon instead. Oh my god. I'm hiding. There we go. I also want to say, I recently remembered, uh, and needed to find pictures to confirm this, but when I was really little and my abuela used to watch me, um, there was one year where I dressed up as Agumon for Halloween. You did? Yeah, it was a it was a little bit of a knockoff because I looked at the photos and it looks like the head shape of the Agumon costume had like a weird kind of horn at the back of it. A very I don't know if that's just because like the back part of it broke off or if that was like part of the design. Uh, because they might have with well, the manufacturers probably thought it was like a Charmeleon knockoff instead of Digimon, but. Uh, yeah, I did. I think I had to, I think I had chosen to wear that for like, did your elementary school ever do this thing where for Halloween, the kids would get dressed up in costumes and like walk around the schoolyard as like a little parade? Um, I don't think we ever did a parade, but we did have costume days. Yeah. So for Halloween, we would do this thing where the kids would have the option to either be in costume all day, uh, which was a free excuse to not wear a uniform to school, uh, or wait until like the end of the day to, to get changed in their costume. And grade by grade, um, kids would go out in their costumes and in a guided like parade style walk around the schoolyard uh, for all the parents to, to see them in. And I, I think I went in that costume. I don't remember if I did, but I just, I do have memories of at least wearing that costume and having it. Nice. So yeah, <laughs> Digimon has lived with me all my life. <laughs> Alrighty, you fucking ready? No, but you, let's go anyway. <laughs> Alright, here's a, uh, beautiful... Metal Brave on, who has every disease. He's got some yeah, he's got he's got some things wrong with him. I I it's a lot. This Agumon is beautiful, I wanna throw it. Yeah, that Agumon I wanna position that Agumon on a shelf somewhere and like build a shrine around him. <laughs> With that stupid bootleg Devimon. <laughs> Same with the Agumon, but for this Greymon. They're next to each other, father and son. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Get out of Get rid of it. Throw it away. Throw oh, it away. No. It is no. 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 Yes, it is. Oh, that's tiny. <laughs> oh, oh that's little. Fine. He's little. That yeah. Agumon one, that Agumon bootleg, perfect. That's like peak bootleg, though. Yeah. She looks like she was left in a hot car. Yeah, that's it. It's like a pretty okay figurine. It's just faded in its colors. That one. <laughs> who? Who? Who Sid from Toy Story styled a Cactar into Togemon? I think I had one of those. I think I had one of those Padamon keychain toys. Yeah, I did. Not, it wasn't, it wasn't wild looking like that. It was still in like, clean condition, but that definitely brings up memories of having one. Really good. Also, we finally switched to sound that uh, soundtrack that doesn't suck. Yay. Aww. Yeah, that one's alright. That one's okay. She's decent. She's like... She's like... I, she looks as small as a DD miniature. Which I can't verify. <laughs> Your D&D party faces up against this enemy, what do you do? Seduce. Charisma check. 
Uh, unfortunately, she has immunity to any charm cast upon her. I'm not uh, casting charm. I'm not twenty to charisma check, baby. <laughs> Unfortunately, she's in a relationship with Angela Mon. But she I respects like your style. Really like your <laughs> Hi, me and my girlfriend saw you down at the end of the cyberspace and we really liked your your URL. <laughs> Do you have the <laughs> This one got left in a hot car too, but in a different way. Oh, child of mine. This oh, is my baby. this is my daughter Godamon, she has every disease. She needs to get vaccinated. She oh. is. Oh, who put who who threw Gabamon's pelt in with the wash? I don't know, he seems pretty happy about it. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> oh, it's a custom like... figure. Yeah, that's a custom one. I wonder what they made her out of. It's really cool either way, I like the chain. Yeah! Oh, you just can't even see that one. No, that one. Unfortunate. That one's my favorite. That one, that one has my favorite Kabu Terry Mon in it. Yeah! Wow. Wow. Why are you Extra like that? Hi. I, I, I have to join on these, like. Where the, where the fuck are you? Oh. There I am. <laughs> wow. So big, it takes me a while to pop it. That's <laughs> definitely the case. <laughs> flying around from above and your voice just echoes before you swoop in. <laughs> That's actually amazing. Let's shrink you a little bit. Let's move cream over. But I need I need to see these digital. There you go. I need This is so good. Oh my god. She's gonna kill him. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> she, <laughs> Angemon is her gay bestie, and she's making sure that his ex does not come near his ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Leave my gay bestie alone. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, ooh. Uh, he, he has seen shit. I I love this especially because it has the picture of who it's supposed to be right above it, so you can straight up compare. Yeah, you, you can just oh my god, Ty had a badass, bad like just an absolutely bad hair day, and then saw some shit. He looks like the Pillsbury Doughboy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this picture is Stevie Ty. That one's just a regular Venom Myotis Mon. I think it is, but I still hate him. Yeah, fair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, look, he looks like he's getting a photo during school picture day. Excuse me, this is a public space. This is a public space. You can't just manspread like that, sir. Thank you so very much for this gift. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> twisted. I've been told several times to stop. <laughs> he pushed over. <laughs> 
when I found this one. I, I clicked this picture and then in the Google recommended there is more pictures of him face down. <laughs> so many! Good. That's the only way I want to display him is face down. <laughs> yes. Oh shit. Oh man. Okay. Okay, that was all of them. That was all of them I've had before. We'll be back to work. Okay. Back to work. Uh I'm gonna go pop off again and watch some stuff on the side. I just like, <laughs> had to join in on <laughs> wonderful world of terrible Digimon. Music. <laughs> Thanks for coming to share in those last moments. It was so good. <laughs> Thank you for sharing that. Oh man. Oh, oh man. man. Oh boy. Enjoy, enjoy tiny, uh, tiny tool. <laughs> Later, Bob. Later. I need a drink. I wrapped and saved so many pictures, I forgot to remove that custom Debbie Wall. <sighs> That's okay. I hope I can finish this today. I'm sure you could. We're gonna find out. It is only 9 p.m., which is surprising to me. I have to, um, uh, add the Gonsdale the Spikes to the back view. But I wanted to wait till I had them blind on the side view so I could understand the shape more. But, excuse me. How's your day been going? Boring. Yeah. Yeah. Do you like that? Yeah. I got to show some people in my server English and Ice Daddy on for the first time. Yay. They lost their shit. It was beautiful. One of these days I'm gonna do a watch party in my server of just the Daddy Mon episode. The Ice Daddy Mon episode. <laughs> oh man. What a treat. The best of treats. Delicious. Thank you, if you will. I will not, thanks. <laughs> Pussy. I will not still, thanks. <laughs> server was saying how um they uh he was watching Frontiers with Mari and once they got to Ice Devimon she just had to stop. That's I'm correct. Like, I'm like what are you talking about? The clip of Ice Devimon is what made me watch it <laughs> No it's correct to stop at that scene. That's correct. No not stop at that scene. Watch the whole scene. Watch him no, no, it's correct, too. There's, a, there's only two correct options, and it's be motivated only by that scene, and stop at that scene. That's uh, it. Uh, ben, you missed us looking at the leg Digimon figures. Other than that, not much. Yeah. Oh man, I nice stepped him on. The Christopher Walken impression certainly was a choice. It sure was. 
The voices for all the antagonists were were decisions made. Like I I feel like you're also underselling the fact that the other antagonists also had some pretty wild like voice decisions. Well, I didn't say they didn't, but I I am biased toward a specific favorite. That's fair. <laughs> uh, we had there was also Jersey Jim Rat uh Arbormon. There's little like what what vague approximate accent would you say that um that uh Golemon had or not Golemon uh Gigasmon has I forgot what his like base form is called Grumblemon Grumblemon um creature I don't think he had a real accent yeah that's fair he kind of spoke funny on purpose uh, there was also Timmy Turner's dad slash Cosmo yes. doing the most, like, <laughs> doing the most Shakespearean speech style for, uh, for, uh, what's his face? Mercury Mon. Mercury Mon. Sorry, all I can think of whenever I see that man or <laughs> think of that man. <laughs> Yeah. All I can think of when I see or think of that man is um is a Sephiroth Mon, big green ball man. That's it. You try it. Fucking keep on. Orbs. And stretch it. Ugh. I'm gonna get rid of uh, the little shirt in on the Chat box over there now that I have it on my shoulder. Hmm. It'll be fine. Uh, and Southern Bell Ronamon. Yes. <laughs> Truly. Ah, shit. I forgot I changed and then the there's... design on this. Yeah, and then there's just Angsty Duskmon, but really that. That one doesn't have a voice change, that one's just your typical edge lord. Yep. He likes to brood in dark corners and listen to uh to uh MCR and Blink 182. Good I want, I'm sorry, I want, I want so bad Duskmon to like, walk up to, to Koji and just be like, you see Koji, when I was a young boy, my father didn't take me anywhere, he was too busy committing adultery. <laughs> Your family? Oh, that's right. Your mother. Your mother! Just a random, random Karatangumon out of nowhere reading Koji's entire history. Just How would he know? How did he know? I, I came across a Koji figure earlier. And I was like, oh. I want to buy it just so I can throw it. Yeah. <laughs> I hate that child so much. Oh, man. He's so bad, he's so bad, he's so bad. <laughs> Me tucking into bed uh, a figure of Takuya, Tommy, and JP, followed by me just gripping with a throbbing vein in my hand the figures of Koji, uh, Koichi, and Zoe, and throwing them into the sun. <laughs> oh, 
Just hit them indeed. Get out of here. Hey, go on. Get out. <laughs> Their designs as humans are so on the nose for their Digimon, it's so funny. Yeah. They are like good fits though. Yeah, like, the, I, I think the character designs for the leading cast are great. Yeah. Like in any other setting, it would have been fine, but, um, writer's team. Writers team, yeah. I we made we made the correct decision to watch it in English because that's the only way watching Frontiers is tolerable because yeah. it's in like because it takes itself so seriously in the original Japanese version. It's like it's just dull and it's yeah. just like a slog to get through. It had the it had the the ghost stories effect of like the original version is just a slog more than it is entertaining. Indeed. Oh man, I would have loved it if they if they went handing it over to the English team to localize it, just that they can do whatever as long as they keep it within like certain parameters. Yeah. I would have loved to have seen what they would have done for 50 something episodes of that series. I still wish I had gotten all of our live reactions recorded for that entire show. <laughs> there was so much good. There, yeah, there was a lot. There, honestly, even yeah, even if not live, just having our like audio reaction would have yeah. been would have been fine in some moments because there were truly there were a lot of moments where I needed to pause the video and just like. And just scream. Yep. And there were so many moments where we had to rewind. I still think about when you told me to pause and rewind to go back because you noticed you caught Pokemon sliding into frame and there was just so much visible. Like, if for anyone who doesn't know, for anyone who doesn't hasn't seen uh, Digimon Frontier, uh, there's a Digimon in it called Pokemon who is part of the like Lee or the main ensemble characters. And there's a scene in one of the episodes where he's like sliding into frame while talking and there's supposed to be just a little bit of bounce to his movement to make him look like he's walking properly into frame, into frame. but whoever whoever was responsible for like recording or moving the PNG for that scene specifically messed up and bounced him a little too high and you can see the entire like cut off section beneath his torso like visibly exposing the background yeah it was it was really bad those are my favorite things to point out it, it I was, was glad you didn't see it at first because it was funny or what i have to make you rewind it <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> and and then later on in the series there's a moment uh where cherubimon is fighting the like or not even fighting, he just finished fighting the two main kids and is stealing their digi, their like detector digi vices. But he's like, he's drawn or his effects are drawn on like one solid plane that is higher up and farther to the left than what the plane the kids on the ground are on. So it's just, it, it, you look at it and you go, where are you aiming with that? What yeah, is that supposed to be doing? Why are you on an it? Like, I, I hesitate to even call it perspective because it was just you were in another dimension, my guy. You were in another, <laughs> you were in another universe doing something else entirely. Yeah, it wasn't good. It was not good. It was not good. 
Uh, and then all he did when he did that was just take their detectors, which I don't know why. Because in any other series, any other Digimon series, if a Digimon goes after a kid, they're usually going to get that kid specifically. I don't know why they went, like, he had them on the ground. At any moment, he could have been like, now, finally, finally, I can't do the, like, the deep, evil, menacing voice that guy does, but it's really impressive. It's like, finally, I have taken down you two, you of the ten legendary warriors. It's now time to end your entire lives here and now. But instead, he's just like, I'm going to whoosh up your detectors and hold them in my big, meaty puppet hands. Big meaty claws. It's my mother's yeah. calling me. Oh. I'm gonna tell her I'm screaming. It better not be an emergency. Okay. <laughs> I love telling her to ask before calling me, and then she never does that. Okay. Oh man. Yeah, the Digimon Frontier series. <laughs> Digimon Frontiers as a series is like not only is it I would say a a C tier series just in general, not not even including Digimon. Hi! Like, it's a C-tier series, not even just in terms of Digimon, but just as a as an anime overall, it's very C-tier. Um, but it certainly didn't help. The, the reason why Frontiers, out of every season, is the most hated by everyone, I would say is a very, like, similar effect to what happened with, um, with Stormblood coming out as an expansion Final Fantasy XIV, which is that Heavensward was a very good expan expansion with a really good story. And Stormblood was an okay story that kind of was disjointed and, you know, lacked focus and had a lot of potential but missed opportunities. And as a result, it became, like, a very hated expansion, even though it's just okay. Frontiers isn't a very good series. I wouldn't even really call it okay. Too much misogyny in it for me to be okay with it. It's but really bad. It's really, it's really bad. bad. But but, like, that experience is enhanced with the fact that it came after Tamers, and Tamers is like chef's kiss. Tamers is so good. Also, Tamers is so I need to tell you what my mother just said to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. I said I'm streaming everything okay, and I want to preface that she's using voice to text because she's driving. She said everything is fine, I just got stuck in Beyonce traffic. <laughs> What is Beyonce traffic? Uh, you know, Beyonce just <laughs> be it's when Beyonce walks through the streets with a wooden bat and a smashing car windows. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Which she's allowed to do. We all know that Beyonce is allowed to do that anytime she wants. Oh! She didn't typo! There's a Beyonce concert in Dallas! <laughs> Oh my god! Alright, I'm sorry, I need to go to Dallas, Texas right now, yeah, actually. No, no, uh, is playing right now! <laughs> Holy shit. Beyonce Great. traffic! I'm stuck in Beyonce traffic. Uh, no, ma'am, you are blessed to be in Beyonce traffic, actually. <laughs> Beyonce traffic. I, That's my new excuse for something if I'm late for anything now. I couldn't fathom what that would have meant if it was a misunderstanding from voice to text. I'm like, what is this supposed to mean? And she meant literally. <laughs> oh, man, oh, man. Actual Beyonce in real life. Beyonce in real life is performing a concert in Dallas, Texas. In Dallas, Texas. Oh my god, I can't speak tonight. 
and it is causing a traffic jam, understandably, and she yes. is caught up in it. Good lord, I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad this discussion was interrupted by the mention of Beyonce, that's exactly what we needed. It was. My mom's been doing lift drives to get some side cash. Um, <laughs> so she, she, um, lifted somebody to the Beyonce concert. Oh, hell yeah. I don't know she did. Mm. <sighs> Beyonce? 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 Me seeing Ursa Luna. <laughs> Ursa Luna? <laughs> that was me when Ice Debbie showed up in, um... In Tamers, because I didn't expect any Debbie Mon to be in Tamers. Yeah. <laughs> so I was like, Debbie Mon? <laughs> I still need to like, go back into the forecast down to see if they gave him the same stupid voice. I, I doubt it, since Tamers came before Frontiers and Tamers was actually good, they wouldn't have to do something that wacky. I still want to know what they chose to voice him as, because I know yeah. I've seen it, because that was one of the few episodes that I saw on TV when it was airing. Yeah, fair. But I don't remember it. I just have phantom memories of Ice Daddy Mon in the train station. I have, I, I have phantom memories of, like, the first, I want to say, two to three episodes of uh, Digimon Adventure 01 and Tamers, because my abuela had Pete. You know, your voice cut out a few times. Oh. What? Uh. No, you didn't hear this. <laughs> what came out of your mouth was my abuela, P. My abuela had those episodes on VHS. <laughs> I'm sure your abuela, P, too. Don't talk about my abuela, P. <laughs> I can and will take you out. You're gonna have to catch me first. Hi, pal. This track has tiny whispering in it. I'm gonna skip it. Oh. Tiny whispering. Tiny What's whispering. it saying to you? Is it the, uh, is it the playlist I sent you? Yeah. Okay. I can't get, I can't wait till you get to, like, one of the tracks later on, because it, it, it's a lot in a good way. I mean, this whole thing's been great. Oh, yeah, Digimon Hackers, Digimon Cyber Sleuth in general has some really good tracks. <laughs> I have to see who did the music for it again, because I think I have an idea. Okay, yeah, I was right. The composer for the um, the music in Cyber Sleuth and Hacker's Memory um, is the same composer for Dangus Rangus. Why would you say it like that? Because I refuse to respect that series <laughs> after what it's done to me. That's valid, but it took me like 10 seconds to realize what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I... It, it's my default, what I call it now, that it just, like, it has no other name in my head, so even when I talk to people who don't know what I'm talking about, I'm just like, right, I need to elaborate. I got another name, you can hear that. Yeah. Dinkleberg. No, because that means I tolerate it enough to have spite against it. <laughs> Is 
is giving it a shitty name, not spite. Giving it a shitty name is a way to try and endear it to me after what it's done to me. <laughs> yeah. It's what I do with Macadamia as well. With the Bocono, my hero. Is that a drawing of Lord Greymon's eyes? Because I know I, I'm very late to, like, meme culture and still am, like, s detached from it, uh, I can understand why. I can understand it, because it's such a good, like, it's like the THX, uh, startup sound when you watch an old movie. It's, it's the same register of, like, low pitch to high frequency. It's that, and to my understanding, it's that, and the, uh, the your cringe from the, the Evangelion comic. The, uh, what's that? What are you drawing? Is that your persona? Cringe. Oh my god. I like the alternate versions of that comic where someone's like, is that your persona? That's so cool. Aww. It is cool. Asuka, I want to know what your persona is. Yes. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, I have to get my hair Okay, so between you and another friend, I have two people that will be available to playtest this uh, RPG system. Nice. But I want to get one more person in just so I have like a nice, uh, like rounded out group that could give feedback. Yes. <laughs> so fluff, if you're still listening, if you want to help, if you want to help test this. done with this actually you barely have to be done with this outside of like colors but um when you're done with this i want to draw lord graymon in the scrungly like official art style of digimon oh please do i can just send you a screenshot of this front this front and back if you want oh yeah if it if it includes the wings that would also be good he doesn't have any wings oh um, does he not oh i thought no, he, he has the 
Oh, that's what they are. I thought they were like, I thought they were uh, an abstraction of wings. No, they're like down the middle. Alright, cool. Yeah. They're referencing his Godzilla spikes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he Godzilla also spice. he also does the thing that Gabumon and Gurumon does, where he Godzilla's himself in order to in order to fly. Yes. I can't believe they did that more than once. I know. Gabumon confirmed. Has metal in it. Yeah. That, that's the song I was waiting for you to listen to. Hello. What's up? I just went to go pick up his dad, so uh, I'm popping in here while he's doing that. Sorry, I just found out to check with the slob boys, and then I just had that dude and you were here and it scared me. Yeah. I forgot to check with the slob boys. Hello. The other night I was standing in the kitchen and talking to my housemates, and my, uh, fridge ice maker started dropping ice, so it made, like, little knocking sounds, and I, it sounded like somebody was knocking on the window behind me, and it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I am so jumpy. Yeah, you're on high alert. Always. You live like a prey animal. I have anxiety. Like <laughs> me too. Yeah, you live like uh, whoop, like a herbo or, or like a rabbit. Yeah. <laughs> I have anxiety. Oh, go ahead. No, I was talking to my dog. You're fine. Oh. <laughs> I moved something and it made something else on the floor. Like I moved the cord and it made something on the floor move, and she's like. <gasps> I'm like, it's fine. Yeah. But yeah, sorry, continue, continue. Yeah, I was gonna say, I also have anxiety, but that causes me to be on, like, red alert in a I'm ready to fight kind of way. Mm. <laughs> yeah, your instinct is fight minus flight. Yeah. I, I actively, I don't have a flight response either. My, uh, my instinctive responses are fight and, like, shut down. <laughs> but yeah, the track you were just on, uh, it was the Masked Hacker one, right? The Masked Necromancer? Yes. Yeah, that one's my favorite from that track. It's pretty good. It's so good, dude. <laughs> also, Hacker's Memory, pretty gay. Is it? Yeah, the main character has a best friend who is like... There's no other way to read it other than he's got a big gay crush on the main character. Good. Oh, Sherman. He's yelling. He's gonna do that. He be doing with that often. Also, yes, Indrid is keeping the um, the vampire guy he made, <laughs> and he's also working on a replacement. I knew it. He was weak. He's making a fucked up, fucked up, uh, undead, uh, or like resurrected uh, race car driver for the, uh, in place of the vampire guy. Ooh. Uh, probably because we were watching uh, videos, um, like I'm not like I'm not really into NASCAR, but like car stuff fascinates me. That's my cis straight guy uh, thing is cars. <laughs> oh no, you're a car boy. <laughs> yeah, dude. Okay, every time I see a Corvette, I don't know it's a Corvette. I just go, "Hey, that car's kind of sexy," and then I get close. I'm like, "Of course, it's a fucking Corvette." <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's your type. Yeah, it, yeah, if. Yeah. Yeah. 
To be fair, like, have you seen a Corvette? They're really nice looking. <laughs> have you seen my wife? She's really nice. It... <laughs> it's like, to be fair, I've got good taste. <laughs> oh, the the Corvette looks like it's making a face like, ah, I'm going to... <laughs> I don't know which Corvette you're looking at. I, I, I just googled Corvette and it's the first few images. <laughs> 2024 Chevrolet Corvette is what the Google image results are apparently. Oh, I'm I'm uh, so I'm on my phone. So the thing I'm getting is uh, Brave because I'm not using Safari anymore because Brave has ad block. Mm. Um, but yeah, so uh, yeah, we're saving that one because as soon as you see like one of the old school Corvettes, you're gonna be like, oh, yeah. Because it's got, like, the iconic, like, white uh, strip down the side. Yeah. <sighs> okay. I need a bathroom break. Okay. And then I'll finish his back slice. Yeah. Be safe. We got you covered. Thank you. Yeah. Let me, uh, actually, hold on, let me, let me break this while I'm gone. Okay, let me go to Google and... There you go. Sick. Yeah. Yeah, just <laughs> Google and desktop, and then just the word Corvette and nothing else. Oh yeah, I see the, the 2023 one. <laughs> <laughs> I love the brain able to see faces in places where it shouldn't be able to. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like I'm my, yeah, like I'm here. Um, yeah, here's. Oh my god. No, not can't not camera. Give me no. Albums. Yeah, here are some two old Corvettes. But I'm like, to be fair, like. Look at how nice those are. Like the, the old one with the white. Oh. Ooh, yeah, I like that first one a lot. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm a car guy, so I can't. I, I, of course, I'm like, you can't tell me that's not like a hot car. <laughs> it is a hot car. Oh no! Oh! <laughs> Look at the front license plate of that first image. Oh no. No. For everyone on stream, it's a picture of a Corvette, but when my eyes zoomed in and hint into the front license plate, the license plate is a Confederate flag. Yeah, yeah, let me let me get a cuz I say I thought I saved two pictures, but I care some more. Is this one a stingray? Um, which one am I? Old, please. <laughs> Banish the license plate, not the car. Yeah. I'm banishing, uh, hold on here. Yeah. Here, uh, delete. <laughs> delete. It is a very good car, though. Yes. Yeah, the the 1961 is the one I'm looking for.
Oh, brave. Okay. Please give me Google. <laughs> Okay, give me a better make that image enhanced, please. <laughs> Zoom in clear, enhance. Clear up the image. Make it not fuzzy. <laughs> Zoom. Enhance. <laughs> oh, I don't hi. Hold on. Right. I'm getting I'm getting pictures of uh, the Corvettes that I like because the first one that I I didn't realize the license plate and <laughs> not great. <laughs> Sound of crackers. Uh, peanut butter cheese. Ooh. Yeah, my um, safe snack. It's a safe snack. Yeah, it's got me up under for protein and it's got a little bit of hard, so if I start getting a little shaky, I can eat this and I'll feel fine. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna be chilling here for a second while I snack. Mm hmm. What's up? I said, look at all these little Digimon. Yeah, look at them all. You got a Vmon. Okay, the party was sounded. Here. I need a new Digimon game. Clear up the image. Uh. Okay, fine. It's not clearing it up, but I found a black one with white and red accents. So. Oh my god, come on. Okay, so yeah, these are your... what uh there is more you haven't listened to yet but i don't know what their soundtracks are like so if i name one it's going to be completely random off the top of my head that's fine that's fine with me so yeah like in that there's the car you can't say it's not sexy because yeah that is a pretty sexy car Oh yeah, it's a good one. Yeah, the the 1960 61 Cadillac Stingray. Uh Digimon World redigitize. That's a pretty short one. Here is a 1970, uh, yeah, 1972. 
I can see the moon. Man, that's hot. It's got the pop up headlights. Did you let him into your room? Yeah. You have to ignore him. No. This is why he meows in front of your door even though it's nighttime. <laughs> He's not You're weak. Asleep. Weak. I am weak. I'm sorry that I love him too much. <laughs> Why, show me the, one of the ones with the headlights up, please. That's like you can see the whole car, please. Be crawling on your shoulder? Yeah, just like this. Be a t-shirt in real. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe Sherman is 2D in real life, too. Oh, sleep, oh man. I'm trying to pet him, but my hand dragon can't quite cover him this ankle. No, no. Oh, there he is. Your hand dragon doesn't understand what you're doing. No. <laughs> It barely understands normal things. I've had a few ghost hands today, where it just lifts up when my hand is up, and I'm like, why are you doing that? <laughs> it's stimming! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, the 1991 also has um, the pop up headlights. Please let me find one with the headlights up. Please. Yes. Permitted. <laughs> yeah, I found one. And I'm like, this is like such a 90s like looking car. I love it so much. <laughs> Let me see his 90s car. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to find it. <laughs> Send it faster. <laughs> you keep me waiting. Oh yeah, are you giving Lord Greymon a tail? Yeah. Okay. Remember, he's got a gun tail. It's got the pop-up headlights. Oh. oh. This 90s ass car, I love it. <laughs> that car can blink. Yes. Yeah, where's his tail? There he is. He's got a gun tail, which I'm gonna rework a little bit. Um, I wanna give it like uh, I don't know what the part of the gun is called where the bullets are held. The chamber. The chamber, yeah. Yeah, I wanna put a chamber there, like on a uh handgun. Like Are you from one. Texas? I am from- well, he's from Texas, and so am I. <laughs> As you forget- I would think you would know all about gun parts. I never shot a gun in my life! <laughs> You're stereotyping me right now. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to have shot one to know about him. <laughs> also, 
sorry. I am now going down. Like, I am now hyper fixating. I'm so sorry. <laughs> You're all right. The old, old, the old Ferraris are so much. Like, I don't like new, like, new Ferraris. No. Look at that 90s one. Oh, I love it. Corey, have you ever watched Ronald Finger on YouTube? Uh, what finger? Ronald finger. Hold on. <laughs> it is car restoration. Oh. Um, I have not, but uh, I do like car restoration. I'm gonna leave oh. it to you, and I'm gonna let you know that his funeral playlist fueled me for years. Hell yeah! It's so good. I'll just link it in collab chat so I just can see it too if they want it. There he is. His editing style is really fun. He's very funny. Nice. Thank you. In fact, I might do a rewatch of his Fiora series soon. It's such, such good for my brain. Nice. Hey, hey, Cream, you know how I gave Fritz a fear of guns? <laughs> yeah. You know how Fritz is just me. <laughs> I can, a, I, I can unfortunately tell you a little bit about gun parts because my dad is a gunhead. My dad's a gun guy. No, that's worse than being a car boy. <laughs> yeah. Trust me, I know. My dad like. Uh, cleans his own guns and stuff like that, and like some of the clean uh, chemicals are just nasty. Smell fucking terrible. Hey, Bull, real quick, can you name me a type of cloud? Can you tell me what lightning is mostly composed of? Plasma. Electricity. Well, well, yes. But how how do you know that? Don't you have a fear of storms? How do you know anything about clouds and lightning and rain when you have a fear of storms, I idiot? I have a fear of tornadoes. Idiot. You, you have a fear of storms! It was, rain, it was hurricaning where you are, and you were afraid. Because guess what happens sometimes when there's a fucking hurricane? It wasn't, a tornado. it wasn't a tornado warning, it was a hurricane! Hurricanes can spawn tornadoes. Okay, was there a tornado warning though? Dude, the tornadoes just happened! They're not gonna warn you days in advance of a tornado is coming. <laughs> yeah, because you got like, uh, maybe an hour or so to be like, hey, this might happen. Sometimes you don't get any warning. Yeah. Like in yeah, Texas, it'll rain, like, it'll be a really calm rain, and suddenly the sirens are going off. <laughs> My point is, you're gonna have a fear of things and know about it. Yes, but you don't have to. <laughs> I will say, the tornado example is not... I know a lot about tornadoes! <laughs> yeah, yeah, do you? Yeah? I know so much about tornadoes! <laughs> Yeah, do you? Do you know so much about tornadoes despite having a phobia of them? Do you, Dunk Ness? Chump? <laughs> you, you want to tell me again how you don't know about guns despite having a, afraid of, a fear of guns? I've never held a gun in my life. <laughs> you don't I, need I, to. I, yeah, you've never held a tornado in your hands either. I've seen them. Have I've you held one? I have fired them, too. Have have you? I know I don't like them. Well, have you have you shot a tornado before? <laughs> have you gone down to the range and held a tornado in your hand and felt the recoil? <laughs> you shot it. <laughs> okay. okay, to be fair, to be fair, BB guns like you might uh, have fun shooting a BB gun because they just shoot like tiny little like metal like tiny tiny balls um, and. It Fun to it's fun to fire those at like metal things and hear them go ping. Yeah. Um, one time when I was like four, I was in um a little playground in our backyard of like, like a higher part, and my neighbors <laughs> started shooting me with BB guns. What oh. the fuck? Yeah. 
It wasn't nice. <laughs> How old were they? They were a couple years older than me. Oh, oh they were sick dead kids. Yep. Yeah, Luckily, they, they were... never hit me directly. They only ricocheted onto me. Um, but it still wasn't nice. Yeah. The... Those are the kind of kids who definitely have shot at people and have been yelled at by their parents that if they do it again, they're getting those things taken away. Yep. Yeah. I think my dad shoot them out. Yep. Deserve. They got those things taken away. <laughs> yep. Uh, gun yeah. safety is important. It is. My favorite gun adjacent activity is laser tag. Oh, yeah. Laser tag is so fun. My my brother uh, is a paintball, uh, or he was, maybe still is, I don't know. Was a paintball <laughs> uh, teenager. <laughs> nice. And to be fair, like holding those and like crushing them in your hand is kind of fun. <laughs> they make a very satisfying pop. Oh, I can imagine the squish. But they apparently do are not fun when you they, you are uh, when someone fires a paintball gun at you without like protection on. They will apparently leave a nasty bruise. Oh, yeah, yeah. Those hurt like, like fuck. Yeah, yeah, it'll leave a welt on you for sure. Yeah. <laughs> also, sorry about forgetting on your case. <laughs> would have actually playfully slapped you if you were really next to me. <laughs> <laughs> My little sister sent me pictures of Pokemon cards she got with her Happy Meal. Aww. And she He's... says, is this the Titan 1 good? I'm like, it's alright. It's pretty. <laughs> It's all right. It's all right. It's pretty mid, kid. You could do better than that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know where they got this, but a few years ago, my little sister went to a birthday party, and one of the gift, the gift favors was Pokemon cards, but they were Korean Pokemon cards. Whoa. I'm like, where did you get these? And why? Yeah. But, um, <laughs> she got a, um, Mega Houndoom. That's like pretty good. I oh. checked this price once, and it's it's one of the better ones. Yeah. I still don't know why it was Korean cars. Where do you even buy those in Texas? Ah. Special order. Maybe. Import shop. Maybe. <laughs> okay, he's got um. This is going to be an interesting yeah. perspective to fix when I make it head on. What are you going to do with the with the chamber on the tail? Um, so, where did I put the tail? Yeah, um, so I, I want to add a gun chamber. Mm. She doesn't have one. Right here. It just kind of ends up as gun and I want to put more effort into it. <laughs> This gun was definitely added after the fact. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess it. I guess it's technically a magazine clip because revolvers, or er, revolvers naturally by default have a chamber and. For a standard pistol, the chamber is when the bullet is loaded into the gun. Yeah. Oh, are you and then, the most uh, common to most guns thing? No, I'm going off of memory in my head. Freeze. <laughs> yeah, I put a parts common to most guns in the, the group uh, on the the stream group chat. The Thanks. side one. <laughs> yeah, I I'm just going based on years of sitting and watching uh, CSI and NCIS with my mom. <laughs> Man, CSI Miami used to be my favorite show to watch with my dad, and I've not retained any of it. Oh, man. Except... 
<laughs> I, okay, the CSI Miami theme song, yeah. I need that as a sound effect. I have to add, I'm gonna write that down. I'm gonna add that somewhere. Yeah, I do know. So there's one part on this uh, on this little thing that uh, is not highlighted on the pistol, and it is that part behind, like right under the the arrow of uh, five, and I believe, if I remember right, that is called the hammer. Yes, it is. Yeah. And if you want to shoot a pistol, you have to pull back on that first. Yep, that's how you cock the gun. Yep. Yep. Nice cock. Thank you. You're welcome. Lord Raymond, when he turns around to shoot with his tail, his point is still He needs to cock his tail first to be able to pull it out. <laughs> He's cocking his gun. <laughs> Cock's gun. Nice cock. Gun's cock. Wait a second, hold on. What? What? <laughs> what, puppy, what? I'm gonna color this no. before giving the tail. It's blue! Yes! Oh, wait, I think I may have donated it. Damn. What are you looking for? I used to have a, um, a Nerf pistol. <laughs> Damn. Oh, I have one of those. Oh, yeah, I, I, I've held Nerf guns. I shouldn't forget that. <laughs> I was trying to think of, like, my most experience with guns, and my brain went laser tag. <laughs> yeah, you, you can definitely count Nerf guns as, like, guns. Yeah. They might look a little wonky compared to, uh, like, laser tag guns and real guns, but that they definitely count. <laughs> Have y'all seen that um, image compilation of fake fantasy guns in movies that are all the same Nerf gun repainted? Yes. No, I haven't. <laughs> Corey, can you find it? Yes. Thank you. Every time I see it, it makes me laugh. <laughs> a Nerf gun would be really good to use as a, as a drawing reference for like a Digimon's gun. Yeah. I think you missed one of the plate layers. No, I know. I had to go around it because the line was broken. Oh, okay. I had to go back and fix it, see? Ah, oh, I see. Yeah, I want to blast that video of the guy throwing bottles down the stairs and having them shatter everywhere. Yeah, yes. Oh my god. It's my favorite. Why does that tickle my pr I I need I need you to know. I had a 4.0 GPA in college. Why did why does a video like that tickle my brain? GPA don't mean shit. It don't mean what? shit. 
why does that why does that do thing to my brain? Why does big chunky clatter and clattering sound make brain go yeah? No different. Oh fuck! There's no brain. <laughs> Oh no. Right there. Oh wait, Bolt, look at the upper thigh. Like right right between the upper thigh and the uh the yes. waist guard feet. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? That's not gonna be a problem. <laughs> so underneath I have um like the base gray layer. Uh, yeah. there's more spots like that on here. Mm. Uh, my line brush is not completely solid, so points like that are very common, but when I'm done coloring, I turn it black, so then the line fills in. Mm. It is okay. Fair enough. Okay, I found some of the- I didn't find all of them, but I found some of the pictures. And you can, uh, share these. Overstream, if you so wish. I would like to. Give me a second. I couldn't find the Nerf gun that is this one, but it was in a thing being like, Nerf guns in movies. Right. And then this one's my favorite. I guess the first picture. Like you just paint a black and it looks like an actual gun. Yeah. yeah. The last one's my favorite. I was like, hey, look. <laughs> it's great. I mean, it's it's a real clever workaround to having to actually mold your own, like, fake gun. Yeah. Yep. Wow. Wow. Yeah, you can you can so tell that's a nerf gun. Like even without the comparison, you can tell that's one. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. I like that this person had to pause it and go grab it from the closet. Yeah. That's why I love that one. I'm just like, wait! I can't. I can't. I recognize yeah. that. <laughs> Hate that, hate that that happened, you gotta ignore it. What happened? Oh, Corey and I said I recognize that at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even hear that, that we said it at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ignoring that it happened. Corey, I need you to know, Bull and I have said the exact same stupid thing, like, at least three times. Oh my god. Yes, and he hates it every fucking time that it happens. <laughs> My favorite one has to be, uh, uh, <laughs> we were watching Digimon, and, um, Where Gururumon is the name of the Digimon, and it shows up, and one of the characters says, Where Gururumon, and then the cream and I at the same time go, he's right there! <laughs> okay, I was the one who was screen sharing it, it was Digimon... Uh, the 2020 adventure remake i had to pause the screen the uh the screen share and turn it off because i was ready to just go for a walk in like <sighs> at like 11 p.m at night it got so bad oh my god <sighs> I, I i hate we made the same stupid dumb joke it was an easy joke to make, to be fair. Yeah. It, I, it was, but we shouldn't have made it at the same time. <laughs> Listen, maybe that's just how that's just how the, the fate dealt it to us. <laughs> oh my god. Hi, Adrian. Hi. Hello.
with the pain cream on my wrist. Oh yeah, here's hey. another here's another one that uh, is a Nerf gun. So it's this the movie is Mega Piranha. Uh, it is a long shot Nerf gun painted black. Mega Piranha. Yes. Get on. Uh... Like you can so tell that's a Nerf gun as well. <laughs> But since Injured is back, I shall be popping off because I've got a little bit of a uh, clip from a show that we were both watching with horror to, wa- to finish watching. Have fun. Yeah. Whichever. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Later. And then the other one that we said, the worst, objectively worst one that we said was uh, that Digimon that was eating other Digimon and they were like, all the kids were just like, that's terrible. And we both just said that's nature at the same time. That one, that one, that one isn't an easy joke to make, which is more infuriating that we both had the same thought. Listen, buddy. Why is my hand doing that? Do you see that? Oh. My hand is not up. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> what were you doing? Oh my goodness. It came back. Did you see that? Yep, I saw it. Is it my shoulder strap? Hold on. Is it this hand? So I, I wear a compression band on my shoulder because I have tendonitis. Um, and it's, it's black, and it's against colorful clothes, so I'm wondering if sometimes the camera thinks that it's a different shape for some reason. Hmm. That might explain the occasional ghost hand. Maybe. Mayhaps, or possibly. Potentially. (laughs) Allegedly. (laughs) I forgot to put the... Armor color on its face. I can't wait to see this model. And they came back! What were you doing? What was that? Cry! I, this is the first time I've been having ghost hands happening on my streams. That's like a common oh. problem with hand tracking, and I thought I was just not having it, but I guess I was just lucky. I just had the most cursed thought. Mm-hmm. Do, do you want to know something I would make for myself if I had unlimited funds and unlimited time? What would you make? Just, I, I, I give that preface because there's no reasonable excuse to make this otherwise. I want a, um, I want to make an Ice Devimon body pillow. Eh, that's not the, that's not the worst thing I heard. It's not terrible. I can't just make something like that, because nobody else would buy it! It's for you. It's- I know it's for me, but I also want to make money. <laughs> if it's I didn't have to worry you about making money, then I wouldn't have to worry about that issue. I would 
would make it for myself if I did not need to make money. I mean, you say it like doing it is going to cost you hundreds of dollars. Time is money. I mean, you say it like doing it is going to cost you hundreds of dollars. <laughs> Somebody donate $80 to me right now. I'll make the ice baby bar right now. Wow, is that what it costs to make a printout for a body fellow? That's not the manufacturer cost, but that's about what I charge for one. Okay, so what's the manufacturer cost? Um, to, like, upload your own image on the site I use, it's like, without shipping. I can actually just go check, hold on. Hmm. Because I gotta tell you, if it's less than $50, Dude, I didn't, I didn't, I'm not financially well right now. That, <laughs> that bootleg Ice Daddy Mon, no, that bootleg regular Daddy Mon is like under $20, and I can't even, like, justify a purchase like that right now. Um, it's 30 bucks to manufacture one of these pillowcases. Quick, someone donate 30 bucks to Bull right now. No, donate 80 bucks so that I can buy food, too. <laughs> Quick, someone donate 30 bucks and a McDonald's Happy Meal to Bull right now. <laughs> Alright, that way they can get the Pokemon cards inside and see if they get any good <laughs> it's, not, it's, it's a Happy Meal that can't have anything crazy good. This is the dollar store, how good could it be? <laughs> Dad, look, it's the good cards. <laughs> is this the Titan good? It's alright. <laughs> There's so many stupid tiny things I want to buy right now. That we played, uh, Demi Mon is the main one right now. I can't help you, I- I blew 50 something dollars to get an Inquiramon Plus. No, you're so valid. And you should have done that. the uh, estimated arrival time? Uh, it said around September 20, or rather it said specifically September 26, but my guess is going to be around that time. Okay. That's not terrible. Yeah, but if the reviews on with that uh, distributor are to be trusted, then I would imagine it probably would get there on that time. Per, you know, unless there are delays from the actual uh, shipping companies themselves. Yeah. Bro, you gave him belt. Broken line. Got it. I did give him belts. Uh, I thought his arm flinched to make it. As if, if, um, if Lore wants to take the claws off for hand tracking, it would have looked sad. Yeah. To be fair, the 
the intent is to be naked because the gauntlets for the design would have been like what covers those parts up initially, but I get what you mean, where you're coming from. Yeah, I, I think Lord Greymon actually has something like that under there. Because um, you, you can take his claws off on his fingers. Um, but yeah, I I'm looking, and he does have stuff around his arms, but every time I look at different images of him, it's always inconsistent, but there is something. Sometimes it's belt, other... Sometimes it is belt, other times it is like cords uh, from his gauntlet to help keep them on. But generally, there is something that is there, like detached from the gauntlet enough yeah. that I I can accept it. Yes. Why are you so inconsistent, War Greymon? It is his nature. Such is the nature of Digimon. This is my favorite part of Digimon design, is that the eyes from the side and front angle are... They're like... They're basically tracking onto a... Onto position because they're always facing forward no matter what angle you look at them. Yeah. Like, that, that's a forward-facing eye. That's not how the eye would look on that thing, but Digimon's like, I don't care, it's an eye. <laughs> it just be like that. Yeah, it do. My, actually, my favorite design element for Digimon, underrated thing, any Digimon that has, like, a metal helm or something on its head, where the eye holes are for the, um, for the eyes to be visible, how there's always that like bit of flesh that you can see right next to it even if the digimon is supposed to be inorganic like golemon the fact that it just has flesh right next to the eye is yeah. like ooh that's creepy in a good way yeah like why do you have why do you have flesh there <laughs> where'd you get that where'd you get that your body's made of rocks homie your head can detach <laughs> Now that I finished 
This file is massive. For a second, from the side angle, just because the uh, the waist guard hadn't been fully colored in on the front and back, I straight up thought that you had drawn him wearing a thong or something. <laughs> I mean, if his tail was in the way, it might have actually looked a bit like a thong. <laughs> it's on his, here on his back view. Oops. Oh my god. Yeah. Speaking of his back view, I have to fix something. Where are you? It's so funny that War Raymond is canonically going into a, into battle with his cheeks out. Yeah. yeah. Definition on his ass. Yep. Does he have the does he have the metal Garurumon like vents on the bottom of his feet? They're rockets. Oh my god. I didn't give him any um any essence of wings, so I wanted him to have something. I mean Digimon can fly without wings, but that's fair. Like, War Greymon especially can fly without wings. But his, the shield on his back at least looks like wings. Yeah, but it's a shield. Alright, time to show you this. It's only 10.30, what the fuck? This wow. Yeah, you have done you've done the thing with this design that Digimon doesn't have, which you thought about the quality of it. What? You've done hang on. Let me, you've done the thing that Digimon never does with its designs, which is you put too much thought into the practicality of it. And by too much thought I mean you put one ounce of thought into it, which Digimon designs don't do. Listen, the only reason I put effort into thinking about practicality Partially is because I know this thing has to be modeled by somebody who's not used to modeling Digimon, so some things have to make sense. <laughs> so, but <laughs> would it not having anything on the bottom of the feet make it easier to model? Oh no, I didn't hear what you were talking about specifically. Your mic cut out. Oh, no, I mean, the thing that I repeated was essentially what got cut out. Okay. Um, do you, <laughs> do you want another funny reason why I actually put those there? Yeah. So that you would have to focus on the feet longer than necessary. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit, your brain. So much like reason here, but you'd be so proud of me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the way you baited me with that, it's for practicality reasons. To make sense. For her, for her to make sense for flight. I mean, they are rockets, that's what they specifically are. Um, I mean, yeah, but like, <laughs> that wasn't the reason, you know damn well that wasn't the reason. It wasn't, wasn't, it? It, wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't at all, you baited me so hard, man. <laughs> I fucking got you. I you fucking got you. You fucking got me, wow. They, they don't need to be, they truly don't need to be there. <laughs> You could have flown, and I would have had no gripes about it. Holy shit. Oh, man. But Lore doesn't need to know it. He doesn't. <laughs> no, Lore doesn't need to know that. No. He's got feet to model. <laughs> model those feet, bitch. <laughs> Zoom in real close so you get that circle perfect. <laughs> this is my trade to you. Are you not going to put in the effort? I went into such detail. 
I said, I said, I said your feet, please, please respond. <laughs> oh my god. Now, what I should have done if I really wanted to make him uncomfortable was to give him nipples. Yeah. He hates nipples. He hates He's correct. So He's correct too. I'm I'm with Lore in that solidarity, honestly. Him having to do these on me, uh, I could I could see it was like pulling nails for him. Lore <laughs> 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 oh, Lore, I see you and I'm standing with you in solidarity for that. <sighs> Alright, buddy, give me another Digimon game. Sure. Let me let me pull up a list of them. Yeah. Uh, Digimon World Dawn and Dusk. Wait, actually, fuck that. Digimon Survive. Have I not done that one yet? Uh, I don't know. Have you not? Have you? Uh, no, no. Only one way to find out. Oops. I guess I have it. Hmm. Um, let me make sure I get the right playlist. That should be good. <laughs> I can't wait till I can't wait till he starts modeling that part and asks, hey, what's this? Yeah. Oh. I was like, oh, it's a rocket. That's all. Yeah. Oh, fair warning. The song called Kizuna in that playlist does have lyrics, but that's the only song that has lyrics. Oh, which? Uh, oh, Kizuna. Which playing right now. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, there's like, I'm sure there's multiple versions that are like instrumental or whatever, but like, yeah. uh, that's the yeah, only one that does have lyrics. Safe. Yeah. Other than that, all of them literally vocal list. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just because that one is the like, that one is the um, like thematic uh, song for this year for the game itself. Um, yeah. It has actual story relevance and importance, which is why, like, if that one shows up multiple times, don't be surprised. Okay. <laughs> but the rest of it, real good. Beautiful. You! You <laughs> fucking got me! I what? You caught me! I caught you what? You got me! Oh, I, go I got you. You scared the shit out of my eye! <laughs> <laughs> Stand right there. How are you doing, pal? I'm doing wonderful. How about you? I'm, I'm, I'm great. <laughs> <laughs> you scared the shit out of me with Seabat. You scared me! Seabat jump scare. <laughs> God. The other day, my housemate Ollie played um, the reverb fart with uh, by paying bits, and it scared me so bad. <laughs> oh. Fucking, I'm so easily jump scareable, except for the vine room. That one doesn't get me anymore for some reason. 
<laughs> it's too funny. <laughs> I've been working on commissions, and I see you're doing the same, or is this a personal This is an art trade. Ooh, nice. Uh, in exchange, War is gonna make some redeems for me. Um, I'm gonna get. He has one where a frying pan drops on his head and flattens it. Um, I want the same thing, but I want the frying pan replaced with Cowboy's fist. So he's gonna Beautiful. make Cowboy's fist for that for me. Um, and he also has a redeem where. He gets shut into a book, and then when the book opens again, he's flat, and then he falls over. <laughs> Aww. I want the same thing, except the book has a Hellboy cover on it. Which is really easy to do, you just slap the picture on it. Yeah. I want those, because the Hellboy video game is about to come out in less than two weeks. I'm so very excited. No, there's, 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 get out of here. There we go. Yep. Sorry. Enough, the, the copyright's not going to catch that. It's not even going to be that big of a problem anyway. Hmm. I have a good background music. What are you listening to? I just noticed your Discord icon. I'm back. I'm so sorry. I <laughs> literally left just as I was about to like give you something. <laughs> it's okay. I'm, I'm specifically listening to Digimon music anyway. Because I'm drawing Digimon. I need to fit the vibe. Did you know the Mario Paint music? Does it not get copyright struck? I did not know that. Well, there's a beautiful cover of it. That I have to show you. Get it. I'm trying to find who I sent it to. I paused my music in anticipation. Yeah. Here we go. Now, now you can put it on. What is this? <laughs> I had a feeling it was gonna be... Some meme shit. I, I haven't even clicked to see to listen to it, but I just... I knew it. I expected it too. Yeah, of course, it's Silver Gunner! Oh, man. My favorite one will always be the uh, Mario Galaxy It's Hip the Fuck Bees song. What? I need to give this to you. Hang on. Please. <laughs> I'm gonna put in chat the song so that people can enjoy it their own. Yes. Without being like subjected to it. <laughs> no, they're being subjected to it right now because it's playing on stream. Oh, it is. Yes. I can't hear it. If you can't hear it because it doesn't play through Discord. <laughs> oh, 
That's beautiful. Thank you. The more people I can subject to this, the better. Beautiful. The Silver Gunner does a lot of videos like that, where they remix a lot of video game soundtracks to some meme music. It's perfect. And this one's my favorite. This one's my favorite specifically because uh, Joel Vinesauce was like listening to the video of this, uh, thinking it was the original song, and then it gets to the and then it gets to, it's hip to fuck bees, and he's just like, what the fuck? I'm playing it. It's, this is because of the giant bee mommy. I know it. Probably. I, I know I gave you that song to listen to, but as you're listening to it, I literally just started, like, watching the G-Light D-Lai Gumai and I Pete Rat video. The what? Oh my god, Hal, I'm glad you get to experience this for the first time. I'm... I'm it's getting a lot of new experiences recently. I don't know I, if I can tally them up to good. You, you need to experience G Y D Y do my pick P trash can I. Yeah, I've linked it. I've oh linked it's it. oh it's the gummy rat person. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, this song truly gets horrendous. Scuppy Pipa Kaki. Scuppy. <laughs> Sucks. <laughs> I've never, like, watched the entire video before. <laughs> it's just, oh, uh, in the fucking video, I hate it. So he can breathe. <laughs> yeah, imagine imagine being me with all of these different audio sources just existing in my subconscious and <laughs> And the fact that I still function the way that I do is astonishing. You're so powerful. You hold so much strength in that being of yours. <laughs> this person sounds like they're having so much fun doing this shit post. It's gotta be. It's gotta be fun to just destroy the English language. And it is, because I do it constantly with my friend. What'd you wake up for? You were so happy. Oh boy. He woke up because he heard that the g li b li he tried Kandai was escaping. Oh man. I feel like I just lost like an immense amount of brain cells just watching that. 
That's what happens. What music was I listening to the other day that, like, I could feel the chemistry in my brain, like, shifting while while listening to it? I can't remember. Ow! Oh, oh no! My sound alert's broke! Thank you, Shelf, for the phone. Thank you, Shelf. Is it getting to me? No, we didn't watch it on stream. We're just talking about it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Fluff. Oh, I was listening to the Over the Garden Wall soundtrack yeah, because, yeah. yes, because I remember Fluff talking about it uh, on, uh, with regards to like his latest RP or LARP rather, uh, and I was just like, you know what? It's September, almost October. It's the perfect season for this. I'm going to, and it's been some time. I'm going to listen to it again, and then I started listening to it, and I I could feel the chemistry in my brain shifting. <laughs> Here, Shaf, I'm gonna test to see if I fixed it. You need to get your follower, Yippee. Yippee! There you go, Yippee! Yay! We got it! Shepherd! Shepherd, what's up, buddy? It does come for us all. Fluff, my favorite song in that entire OST is, uh, Old Black Train. That song, every time I listen to it, it gives me chills. We we drop a lot. No sir. He's trying to steal my neutral green bar. But he's hungry. He does not need a neutral green bar. He's hungry. He, has food. he wants the power from your neutral grain. No. He That's knows my power. it could he knows it contains many essential vitamins and minerals for building a strong body. Are we a sponsor? No. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> okay, I have an English question. Bricked up does not mean, like, right? What? Does not mean what? Does it mean buff? Bricked up? No. No. Oh. <laughs> Okay, I was about to say your cat wants to be bricked up, but that's- no. I don't think- no. What does no. it mean? Doesn't that mean, like, erect? Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, it does mean that. Whoops. Good to know. Good to Are know. Um, in other contexts? Oh no! Your silence is deafening. <laughs> I, I thought, cause, oh my god, like people were using it to describe some of my characters. It's like, yeah, they're they're buff. I get it. No. 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 <laughs> it means you live there literally erect. Oh, yes. Bricked up. Not burped. Where did my oh, captions yeah. go? Why are my captions <laughs> broken? Hey, captions, come back. B R I D K E D. Brick. Like what I throw at captions, you. Captions, captions, captions. Brick. Like the house that I resemble being built as. Uh, I'm a brick. Oh, it's not captions are just broken. They're gonna take a breather. Oh no, the captions are the only way to comprehend you. <laughs> oh no, I guess you just have to use your ears and your brain and adjust to my voice like an accent. <laughs> oh my god. What? This, uh, this track that's playing, 
sounds almost exactly like the track that plays in Alice in Wonderland and Kingdom Hearts. Like, I, I thought I was listening to Kingdom Hearts music for a second, I was like... <gasps> what the fuck? I, I can't hear the music on stream, by the way. I know you can't. Are you listening to it privately by yourself? No, you, you can hear it on the stream itself. You just won't be able to hear it through Discord. No, I I just unmuted the stream so that way I can hear which track you're talking about and there's nothing. It's Seth that's playing. And Is it's playing? Fluff, it. Fluff, can you confirm or deny because I I might need to, I guess, refresh my... Hold on, I can check on my phone. Okay. Yes, yeah, playing. That music is I guess I need to refresh. Playing. I guess I need to refresh. I guess you do. Oh, there it is. I hear it now. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's the fun incidental music. I like that one. <laughs> Has it gone to the spooky tracks yet? Not yet. Okay. Wow, it's really saving it. I thought those would have been, like... Those are so readily used in-game. I thought they would have been the first tracks. Well, none of these tracks are, are named, except for, like, a handful, so it's kind of hard to know when that's coming. Oh. Oh, boy. Okay. My captions came back. Sometimes they just need to take a breather. Your captions needed a coffee break. Yeah, they're like, I can't deal with you. I can't. <laughs> They're like, oh god, be like, be like, what the fuck is this bullshit? I can't. <laughs> what do you mean, be like, be like? My captions don't know what that means. No, they don't. Your captions are not going to be able to comprehend that. Be like, be like. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy. Jimmy! Jimmy! My new favorite thing that I've... that I've started saying, because I came up with it like a day ago, to describe my dog, is just big rig trucking berserk. Oh. I love your dog. I love him too. Hi, Sherman. Sherman he's... also loves your dog. Oh, thank you, Sherman. He's only eight months old. He's just a little guy. He's such a baby, but he likes to jump on everyone and everything. Sherman's eating my hair. Sherman. <laughs> That's not how you gain power. He's grooming me. Aww. Ah. He's just being gentle right now. Sometimes he'll put his paws on my head to, like, uh, balance himself and his claws, so that fucking hurts. <laughs> but we're fine. Oh, you are? The family cat, uh, managed to run past my mom today and get into the basement. Uh, so I had to follow the both of them downstairs and, like, keep an eye on the cat to make sure... That she didn't like go any place that she wasn't supposed to or escape somehow and like i picked her up and that cat likes to hiss whenever she's getting removed from the basement because she likes to explore uh but this is the first time that she was actively like wriggling and physically moving about in my hands and so i had to put her down to keep her because i didn't know if she was actually going to start like freaking out in my hands and scratching me oh man while you were telling that, he did what I said he usually does, and he put his paw on my head and cloughed me. Yay! Sherman violence. Sherm, 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 Sherm. That's how he establishes dominance. <laughs> <laughs> what are you gonna do? Stop him? <laughs> I love my baby boy Sherman so much. <laughs> 
is he is everything to me. My world would shatter without him. Oh. I've he's not usually allowed in my room at night time when I'm sleeping, but that was only meant to be temporary while I was moving things in because I don't want him messing with the stuff on my floor when I'm sleeping. Uh, but okay. it, there's just been so many roadblocks in getting my uh, stuff unpacked that he hasn't been allowed to sleep in my room at night time. And I, I'm, I went to let him in, but he just got mess my stuff. He's got to mess with my stuff. Are you still not fully unpacked yet? No, I don't have enough shelves to put things on. Damn. My room's been a, um, in-progress nightmare this whole time. That's I'm really, fair. I'm really pissed about the wallpaper situation, because uh, somebody came out here and said that I had enough wallpaper, and then when the other guy came to install it, he said I didn't have enough wallpaper, so there's just a massive, giant gap on part of my wall where wallpaper is supposed to be and I can't afford to get that finished. Ugh. It's so expensive. Well, why don't you just put the wallpaper on yourself? Because the wallpaper itself is $300. What the oh. hell wallpaper are you using? Normal wallpaper. What the hell? Wallpaper is expensive, dude. Three hundred dollars, though. Yes. Wouldn't it be cheaper to paint? It's it's not a solid color. It's a picture. It's a it's a pattern. It's wallpaper. Hmm. I wanted to have a singular feature wall, so I got one roll of paper, thinking that was enough for one wall, and I was told that was enough, and that was a fucking lie. <sighs> And it also costs money to have somebody else install it. Where did you buy this wallpaper from? Wallpaper Direct. <laughs> Bro, I think you're getting scammed. It's not a scam. Wallpaper's just like that. Fucked if I up. wanted, like, really shitty, ugly wallpaper, I could've gotten it for way cheaper. But I specifically wanted something nice for my room. So I shilled for the one roll, thinking it was enough. And it's not. So now I have to wait God knows how long to get it finished. I have a solution. What? Tear that part of the wall down and install a window. It's in the corner. Did I stutter? <laughs> you can't put a window in a fucking corner, you piece of shit! Yes, you can. If you're not a fucking coward. <laughs> yeah, I see, that's it. Do you want to know what it would cost to, to get a window installed? More than finishing the wallpaper! Install it yourself, coward. <laughs> I'm gonna fight you. Okay. 1v1. <laughs> December. You I'll be tell there. Me how much buying a window costs, how much it's gonna cost to break it down. Probably less than your fucking wallpaper costs, I'm gonna be real with you. Not. Absolutely, Absolutely yes! Are you are you wiling it right now? Let me Google, how much does it cost to put a window where there isn't a window? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> The fact that your wallpaper is three hundred dollars gets me so bricked up. Oh my god! Buddy, everything for houses are so fucking expensive. The fact that you even suggest that as a cheaper option genuinely pisses me off. This uh, the stream is a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Every stream that I join is a fucking nightmare. Holy shit. This stream is a fucking nightmare. <laughs> for the for fucking what? <laughs> I, I, <laughs> God. <laughs> Please, 
will tell me this answer. I'm not trying to fill out a house project. Take the survey. Bricked up for cheap home decor. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Nothing gets me bricked up more than affordable <laughs> interior design. Absolutely. Almost $400 for an average price. And that's for oh, a shitty window. Yeah. And you get a nice window. And you get a nice you get a window. window. You get a shitty window for four hours. It's better than wallpaper. You get to see the outside. You get the sun. Are you paying for the win? Are you paying someone else to install the window for you, or is that the cost to do it yourself? Dude, doing it yourself is still gonna cost money. You have to buy a window. You have to know what you're doing, which I don't. Yeah, you have to figure out how to split a window in half so that it fits the corner too. You also have yeah, to that... not break down. There's a wall there. <laughs> That's why you have and to get have rid of the to wall. We have to figure out the supports because we're gonna we gotta move the supports. Uh, we're gonna have to find new supports. That window is the glass isn't gonna be able to sustain that part of the wall anymore. Yeah. <laughs> the ball is depressed. Dude, I'm, I'm genuinely, like, really stressed out about my house. Like, I think y'all are being funny, but I'm actually upset about this. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry. It's okay. <sighs> and it's like, since the wallpaper is so expensive, I can't install it myself because I will mess it up. So it costs even more to get somebody else to install it. What's the Do you think you'll mess it up because you don't have help? I have shaky hands. And wallpaper. I don't. Wallpaper and I'll is... be I'll be in the vicinity in December. Well, wallpaper, especially one with a pattern like this, requires like such precision. I saw the guys okay. do it themselves. They came to my house to install it and cut it. And it took a lot of tools that I don't have, and a lot of precise measurements that I oh, don't understand. Oh, okay. So it's, it's That's... not... It's, it's definitely, like, not an easy thing to do. It's not just a peeling stick. What's the okay. wallpaper pattern? Oh, I'll show you. Yeah. Well, just take a picture of it and post yeah, I'm, it. I'm doing it. Oh my god, your arms. <laughs> yeah. The bull just, like, fucking contorting. The weird part is, um, my face and arms were going the same direction, but my body mirrors motion, but my hands don't. Hand tracking was recently added to my VTuber program, and they've not figured out mirroring, it, mirroring yet, apparently. No. There you go. It's a little attached chat. Yeah. Oh, that's not bad. Man, not that pattern gets me bricked up. <laughs> not bad, he says. <laughs> uh, this is gonna be my new bit, I'm sorry. <laughs> now that you know what it means, you can use it with confidence. <laughs> yes. Because I, I thought it was like, you know, buff because stacked up like a brick house. Yeah. That's fair. Yeah. There's uh, an even more annoying but less intrusive wallpaper problem in our house. So I had wallpaper for two rooms. The other room was way cheaper wallpaper. Mm -hmm. um, but the guy was coming out to install both at once, so it would be like one and done cheaper. Um, nice. <laughs> Again, I had somebody out here to tell me if I had enough wallpaper, and she said yes for both rooms. And it was a no for both rooms, actually. And this, this was wallpaper that was meant to go in my bathroom. 
And there is a sliver of note wallpaper behind the bathroom door that's this thick. This thick is my fingers. You can't. If the door is open, you can't see it because it's behind the door. But it's there, and it makes me so mad. Because I'm like, I was lied to, and I had to waste money because of it. That one actually one was like a more honest mistake since there is not a significant amount. Like, considering the dimensions of the entirety of the bathroom, like, that's a. That much seems like a whole lot, but based on, like, I don't know, trying to, to measure it out entirely, that feels like a fair mistake to make. But well, the, the one of your room is, is absolutely, like, in. Yeah, that was unholy. The, the bathroom one, though, it was like, it's, again, on one wall in a bathroom. It's just a feature wall. Um, mm. And what pisses me off is I can't, like, order half of a roll or something. So if I want to finish that one quarter, I have to buy an, an entire other fucking roll for that three inches against the wall. Ah. Ah. I hate house. Is that one pattern too? Yeah, it's a way, it's a way cheaper one though. I don't know if I have a picture on hand. How much? How much cheaper? It was. Yeah. Um. Trying to remember. Mm -hmm. I want to. I want to say like one sixty. That's better. That's decent. yeah. That is better. Yeah, and it's got shiny gloss on it too for the the little gold parts on it. I could just go take a picture of my bathroom. Yeah, you can take a penis break. <laughs> I, I already went to the bathroom recently. But I, I guess since I'm standing up, I should do it again. Yeah. A peepus break. Peepus break right? time. We'll, we'll keep some entertained. Or I'll start break dancing. Yeah. Who? Yeah. Break up dancing. <laughs> I love whenever I see fucking bricked up and then it makes me laugh. It's so good. <laughs> You've heard of break dancing, get ready for bricked up dancing. <laughs> <laughs> God. $300 for wallpaper is fucking absurd. Yeah. Holy shit. Like I've I never... bet it was nice wallpaper, but still. Yeah, Holy I've shit. never heard of wallpaper being $300. How much have you heard of wallpaper being, though? That's the thing. In today's uh, economy? Well, I mean, in today's economy, that's fair. And they're buying it from, like, a specific website, so I'm sure that website probably upcharges as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I... My, my dad is, like, a handyman with uh, certifications in a lot of, like, different, uh, construction fields and projects, including, like, boiler maintenance, and constantly gets his licenses renewed. So I constantly forget that, like, other people don't just, like, grow up in a household with, uh, an adult figure that has taught them how to do, like, basic construction work. God, I wish my father fucking taught me. <laughs> Yeah, so I dude I'm knows sitting... how to even fix trains. He can fix trains, Holy shit. semi trucks, any fucking thing. He hasn't taught me a lick of shit. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I'm sorry. Because I'm a female. Wait. No. Oh, you guys. I love sexism. Mexican. I love Mexican culture. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Puerto Rican, so I'm only like separated by a few degrees, but I am also born a guy, so it's Latino culture. It pretty homogenous. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, my like my dad being the way that he is is like the exact reason why I can look at wallpaper and go, yeah, I can put that up. Alright. All right. Yeah, you, normally whenever I, I have to do something for a house, it's I Google it, I watch YouTube videos on it, and if I know I can do it comfortably, I'll do it. And because I refuse to just have random people I don't know in my house. Like, I, I did all the... I had a friend teach me how to do, like, 
cutting for Ethernet wires mm -hmm. to wire all the Ethernet in my apartment. Yeah, if I have to do, like, either maintenance stuff, uh, I call my dad to instruct me on what I need to do. And if it's usually just, like, general home cleaning, um, I'll either call him or my mom, depending on who's available at the time. Absolutely. Latino parents always know how to clean everything. Oh my god, yeah. And I, I've inherited that as well, because I, I, I know how to clean a bathroom very thoroughly and very, like efficiently mm-hmm I know how to clean a car really really well because my dad does used to do car detailing Ooh. it was really nice I got my car detail for free it was <laughs> very nice oh hell yeah I'm like hey if you're gonna use my car and you're gonna put the dogs in the car you have to detail that afterwards and it's like <laughs> deal that's a good trade-off I, I see that infuriating little sliver yes. missing in your bathroom wall. It's so upsetting. I feel for you. It's so upsetting. So, like, oh my whenever God. I can finally afford uh, to buy more wallpaper, what I'm going to end up doing is stretching it from that wall to the wall over the door, too, so that I can make it worth it. It will definitely mm -hmm. have enough for that on another roll. But, Jesus Christ. Yeah. And if, if any of it gets ruined by any sort of cleaning product or something, then you have replacements. Yeah. Um, yeah. Most most of our house work we've done ourselves. I painted my whole room. I painted the office. Nice. Uh, my brother also painted with me. Uh, we scraped the popcorn off of my ceiling and the office ceiling. Like anything we can feasibly do by ourselves, we do. But if I want something done right without the risk of having to waste money, I will find somebody to do it. Absolutely. Especially with um, wallpaper as nice as the one in my room, I am taking zero risk with that. I do not want to fuck it up. Yeah, you want you want to, if they fuck it up, they pay for it. Yes. Hmm. Also, I, I, I wish I had checked the clock when I went to the bathroom, because it's like almost time for me to take my meds. I should have taken them while I was in there. Oh. That would have made too much sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. Maybe. There's nothing stopping you. Well, I just, yeah, oh, I just don't take them. We, we've, been, we've been talking about Latino culture and the, the wonder of being able to clean anything. Yeah. <laughs> Did you know that what cold water is the best to clean blood off? Yes. Instead blood. of warm water. Yeah. I didn't know for blood specifically. I did know that, but my mom is also a nurse, so there's reason for her to tell me that. <laughs> well, I'm a female, so there's reason for that for <laughs> me. Yes, you know, sometimes your feet get blood on it that isn't caused by murder. Yes, yeah. sometimes, yeah. Sometimes, blood does not equate to murder or injury. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I, I know that, but, but, like, the fact that I know about how, like, what the effective way to get blood out of clothes is, I, because I, again, is bo am born male, I should specify why I know how to get blood yeah, out absolutely. of clothes. I mean, well, yeah, absolutely. Well, well, I assumed it was you. because Latino mom, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. Your mom, well, like, I assume, I say, also had a period at some point in her life. I mean, yeah. There you go. <laughs> it's but really like, funny. I've talked to a lot of people with menopause, and they forget about periods. And th when I'm like writhing on the floor, dying, and they go like, "What are you? What are you, a pussy?" I'm like, "Didn't you have periods too, motherfucker?" And they're wow. like, "Oh yeah, I forgot." There's that, and also periods aren't supposed to make you feel like you're dying. You should actually go to a doctor. I did go to a doctor. I found out I got the worst... Like, I'm, I'm sorry for my words. I got the worst pussy lottery imaginable. <laughs> I have, like, I have, like, three different conditions that all contribute to me having the worst time possible. Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> Damn, such the sun. Yeah, 
The skill issue. And I also have like crazy bad periods. And the doctors couldn't figure out why, because I didn't I wasn't showing symptoms of anything specific. Um, so mm-hmm. I got put on birth control and that seems to have fixed it for now. It could be endo, because sometimes endo doesn't show up on scans. Awesome. Awesome. And my recommendation for that is uh, either primrose oil or omega-3 as a supplement to assist with uh, folic acid production in the body. I see. This was recommended by my uh, psychiatrist, who is a trans woman and works for the gender clinic. Cool. So I'm not just pulling this out of my ass. <laughs> no, I, I, I didn't assume that you were. <laughs> yeah, but just in case, for people listening who may also have a bad time. I'm not pulling this out of my ass. A medical professional recommended this. Also, curcumin, which is sold as a vitamin. Um, it comes from turmeric. If you're allergic to tur- turmeric, don't take it. Curcumin se- severely reduces inflammation, which is the main cause of pain during periods. Nice. My birth control seems to be doing pretty fine right now, there have been weird things with that, so if those weird things continue, I'll definitely consider that. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, uh, oh yeah, no, sorry, it was four conditions that are fucking me up? Oh no. I'm uh, also intersex. Oh, congrats! <laughs> Congratulations! You have everything! I have everything. This is my son, Pao, who has every pussy disease. <laughs> I think you killed Pao. This pussy can hold every, every disease. Every pussy disease. Get. Thankfully, no. Thankfully, not everyone. So many. <laughs> so many. Pussy game. So many week. pussy disease. Oh, um, when we got this house, we had to buy a new air conditioning unit. Do y'all know how much it costs to completely replace an HVAC? Too fucking much. AC Take units are like an insane amount. Like, uh, 5k? No. Higher or lower? More? More. More? <laughs> yeah. It's 7,000. Oh. What the fuck, dog? Yeah. I thought it would be less because it was USB, itself. but no. Like, the installation cost was not much of that. Most of it was for the unit itself. Yeah. And, like, we did our research to make sure that was not, like, a scam. That's how much they cost. Yep. Th- that one I agree with. <laughs> Fuck, AC units in the South. It- oh my god, there's a parts shortage in Canada right now? No. So it took us, like, almost two years to get our AC fixed when it broke oh, down. Shit. It was... It was not good. It was like one of Canada's worst heat waves. That sounds like a not good time. Yeah, we we had to like set um set up doggy pools outside for the chickens. Oh, poor chickens. Yeah, they were fine. They had their doggy pools. They got for that. They got to go for a nice swim. Yeah. yeah. And, like, They're sweating least, bowls. At least now that we got this new AC unit, um, it's one of those things that makes the house raise in value, so whenever we sell it, we'll have that to add to the cost. Mm-hmm. And it is a good AC unit. This thing is fucking powerful. I can't wait, nice. to, I can't wait to use it in the winter, because we've only had to use it for heat so far. I don't 
I love your model, like, randomly freaking out with the arms. <laughs> I can't wait until you get to the typing part of the ref, and then your model fucking freaks out. Oh, I can just do that if you want. <laughs> God, I'm still dying about the every pussy disease. <laughs> Dude, uh, you can't just hit me with that. How? How? You went to the doctor and you were diagnosed with a weak pussy game. <laughs> you had everything but a gorilla grip pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have you know. I've got yes. a decent grip. <laughs> my grip, my pussy grip is alright, it's fine. It's, it's average, it's average. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to be like a fucking boa constrictor. Like, goddamn. Coward. <laughs> oh, there's a VTuber that, I, uh, that I'm buddies with that has like a Kegels redeem. Whoa. Everybody does Kegels together wow. when it's redeemed. Doing Kegels with chat. Um, well, there was their partner, I think it was their partner, spoke up in chat and was like, yeah, um, my butt is tired. I'm like, dude, you do not you, you do not flex your butthole for Kegels. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Also, I realize I got a shape wrong here, so yeah, fix it. <laughs> well, they're gonna have a stronger grip. <laughs> yeah. They're, they're <laughs> Every single time, no, their pelvic floor is gonna be exhausted. That's what's gonna happen. When you do oh, Kegels man. too much, your pelvic floor dies. Oof. They're, they're like, um,. Patrick, who's doing that episode of Spongebob, where he's flexing his butt cheeks. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep exercises. Yes. What is, like... Oh, there we go, cheeked up. I was about to say bricked up, they're bricked up. No, they're cheeked up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there you go. You get the cheeked up and caked up both work. Oh my god. <laughs> but you can you can get bricked up if someone's cheeked up enough. <laughs> I can't deal with you two tonight. <laughs> Is, is this the kind of commentary you wanted while you draw? Full? Yes. Is this me? Okay. Indeed. Cool, cool, cool. Oh my god. I don't. I think. I think Pow and I are not allowed to be in the same stream together. <laughs> like the feedback loop. Her feedback loop of stupid. <laughs> What? What? I say it. I don't fucking remember. I was, my brain stalled. No. I was trying to fill the quiet. Can't believe it. Yeah, when you put two Latinos in a, in the same chat, shit gets smile. <laughs> yeah, which is which is funny because I never got a lot. This is a uh, hi, uh, background history with Hull tonight. Hi, I I never actually <clears throat> felt comfortable hanging out with any other Latinos growing. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, I just I. I just simply didn't feel like I vibed with them weirdly enough. 
It really depends on like how they were brought up. For example, mm. my parents were very open-minded. Mm -hmm. So, it led yeah. to me being more open-minded. Yeah, same. Which was really funny, because like in middle school I was homophobic. <laughs> I didn't know what gay was, and I went to church, and in church they told me gay was bad, so I was okay. like, well, gay must be bad. Uh, and then I, I, but I didn't know what gay meant. Oh, uh, okay, so you, I, I got it, I got it. I was like, oh, that's bad. That's real bad. Yeah. And then I looked at this girl, and I was like, she's really crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and then in high school, I still hadn't outgrown it yet. I'd just gotten like transferred to high school in a different country. And I was like, okay, cool. Um, yeah, I'm gonna vibe. I'm gonna wear my anxiety jacket. I'm gonna put my hair up. I look real butch. Whatever. I don't care. Everybody called me a lesbian. Everybody. Oh my god. Everybody thought I was a lesbian. I'm like, I'm not a lesbian. And then like two weeks later, I got a girlfriend. Oh my god. Everyone knew you were a lesbian before you knew you were a lesbian. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm sorry! That's <laughs> <laughs> so funny! Or like, um, the, I'm not trans, but I relate to that. And that went on for like, three years. No. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> It's me. You were trans. Or you like everybody in high school time. being like, all of my friends were autistic, and they were like, yeah, you're autistic, right? I was like, what are you talking about? I go to go ask my parents, and they're like, oh yeah, the doctor saw you're autistic too. Like, thank you for telling me. That would have been so helpful. What do you mean the doctors diagnosed you with autism already? <laughs> yeah, I've been. It wasn't like an official diagnosis, it was like a, a buddy who was a doctor was like, yeah, your kid's probably that. Oh my god. And then I went to an actual psychiatrist and she was like, mm, well, I don't know. And then I told her, oh yeah, I can't touch cotton or like, I shrivel up and die. And she's like, okay, that sounds a little autistic to me. <laughs> it's a little autistic to me. Oh man, no. I had a lot of the opposite in that because I had depression, like, throughout middle school and high school, uh, I was oh unfortunately God, very dang. straight passing. Yeah, I was very straight passing as a result. So people were surprised when I would tell them, like, yeah, I'm bisexual or whatever, because I was still figuring out. But mm -hmm. I knew both anyway. But, um... And so when I came out, they would always be, like, so shocked because I seemed extremely, like, heterosexual. And so I was just like, <laughs> just... I didn't know how to feel about that. <laughs> You're too normal. I'm sorry. You can't do that. <laughs> like, like, wow. Uh, on the one hand, I guess I'm good at this. On the other hand, I'm too good at this. Whoops. Whoops. Uh -oh. But yeah, and then... Look, <laughs> Okay. Knowing you now, the thought of anybody, like, pointing at me, like, too normal, is fake. <laughs> <laughs> you drop, like, points at your art. I'm sorry. Yeah. I know what <laughs> no, you are. You, yeah, look directly at me and tell me that I'm heterosexual at my model right <laughs> no, now. No, I know what you are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but... I also, I also had undiagnosed ADHD for, like, the first 20-something years of my life. I want to say, like, uh, I didn't get diagnosed until, like, the beginning of 2019, maybe 2020. Oh my god, so, same! <laughs> yes! So it's very recent. So I went my entire life just, like, un-, un like, completely unbeknownst to myself, I went through my entire life masking because I didn't know that, like, the way that I behaved, like, I knew I was behaving, like, or at least having feelings in certain ways that were just, like, not really the way that people behaved in a social situation. 
but like I thought other people also felt that way and were just like also good at hiding it. <clears throat> and then years later, I finally get diagnosed and it's like, you have, oh, you have ADHD. And I'm just like, what? I, no, I don't. Do I? And yes, I do, because I, yeah. then my psych gave me, like, uh, my psych gave me, uh, oh, what's the, what's the ADHD medication? Uh, not the one I'm currently on. The, yes, that. My psych gave me Adderall to try, and was just like, you know, try this for a few days, see how it turns out. And I tried it, and for the first time ever in my life, I could sit down and read a fucking book and not get antsy about it. Yeah, fucking getting, incredible. Getting the later in life diagnosis is always like, oh, are you kidding me? This whole time I could have known and had help? Yeah. Oh my god. Like, uh, I, I actually had to drop out of high school because of uh, how bad it was for me to focus on anything. And I even went to places to seek diagnoses for something, but they were not like legit testing sites. Oh no. So they they screened me and the screening was bullshit and they said I didn't have anything wrong. So because of that, um like my teachers didn't know what to do with me because they weren't equipped to deal with ADHD or autism symptoms. And they they fully believed I didn't have anything because I got tested. And uh and then I'm like okay I guess I'm just a failure then <laughs> It was so sucky. It sucked really bad, but yeah. later, later in life, finding out that there's a reason for everything to happen, I'm like, well, jeez, <laughs> I wish I'd gone somewhere that could tell me that. Yeah, uh, like, the closest thing I had to ever, like, suspecting anything was, you know, reading Tumblr posts from, like, people that have ADHD. They're Same. just like, things, yeah, things ADHD people do, the leg bounce, which, like, I've done my entire and just thought that's a thing that, like, yes. people do sometimes. No, people with ADHD do that because they sit for too long and they're like, I have energy. Get, I need to get this out of my body. Yep, that and just any other stimming. Oh, my caption's on again. Um, one of my stims, um, that was very frequent in middle school. Uh, after the movie Happy Feet came and that came out, I was like obsessed with it to the point of watching it on repeat for like an entire day. That makes um, sense, that makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> That should have been the sign! That should have been the sign! It should have been, but I didn't know any better. No, nobody in my family knew any better. But yeah. one of my stims at the time was tap dancing. Oh, so Beautiful, just, that's adorable. It, it was cute, but it was also loud and annoying, so people got mad about it. <laughs> so I'm like, I just, I gotta move, so I start tap dancing, and people are like, why are you doing that? And I'm like, why aren't you doing it? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you tap dancing, idiot? Yeah, it's just like the things in your brain that make sense that like other people sh with, and you're just like, why? This makes perfect sense. Yes. Oh Christ. Oh my God, I have another funny doctor story. Yeah. So I, I was, I know it's gonna be funny. I was going to the gynecologist. <laughs> <laughs> and and they start asking me like the preliminary questions mm -hmm. about like oh um do you have this do you have this like uh is there anything else you should know about I'm like oh no I don't think so everything's good uh it's gonna be a little awkward because it's my first time going but it'll be chill and they're like oh well does your PTSD have anything to do with this I'm like my what whoa do I have huh your what <laughs> I don't I don't have that. And they're like, well, it says here on your file you do. What? Your file? What? Huh? You Hello? You had that on your file and your doctors never told you? <laughs> what do you mean your PTSD? <laughs> I mean, it makes... I just went, oh, it makes sense, I guess. I gotta talk to my psychiatrist about this later to fucking tell me what she puts on my diagnosis sheet. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's so fucked she up. probably just <laughs> forgot. She's a really good doctor. She just probably forgot. Dude. Oh man. Oh, she probably thought, you. oh, you probably already know like that. That's the thing. Obviously. 
I got to tell Kareem about an ADHD symptom that he didn't know about the other day. Yes, we are from watching Digimon yes. Frontier! We were watching Digimon Frontiers, and there's an episode where um, one of the characters is like fighting with his inner self, where it's like fighting yourself down, being like, ah, oh, everybody hates you, they all don't like you, they're just using you. Um, and like the way it was framed was just straight up like RSD. Um, and I said, oh my god, he's having RSD. And Cream was like, what is that, Wolfon? Song of Thirst, Song of Thirst, yeah. Oh, fuck. RSD, my- Did you know that RSD can interface with PTSD? And become a PTSD thing? Yes. I didn't. So, until recently. <laughs> so, um, he's like, so what is that? And I'm like, oh. <laughs> so I explained to him, oh, it's when you have ADHD and or autism and blah 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 blah. blah. And he was like, oh, that's an ADHD thing? Yep, because guess who has that? Guess who grew up with that and didn't realize that that's not a thing that people experience on average? Yep. Bro, I've been having it really bad. Like, this year was all like, oh, I love being normal. I love being normal. Dave. <laughs> I'm so normal. Every time a new thing that I do is listed on somebody's symptom sheet, I'm like, stop! <laughs> I no. get it. I get it. I have every mental illness. Oh no, you have every single one! This is my son, Bull. <laughs> Who has, he has every the mental, mental illness? Ill. <laughs> every single one. Oh no. I yeah, have... I. Wait. No, I was, gonna, I was gonna make a joke saying I have, um, I'm trying to remember what it was called. Pussy disease? No! <laughs> that like, this is my stuff? Illness. Do you, do you oh. guys know about the mass hysteria thing where everybody started dancing till they die? The what? You've not heard oh of Oh my that. god. What the fuck are you talking about? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna read a Wikipedia article. The oh, not really. There was a there was a shirt that was like, um, oh, let me find it. I I don't need to hear this actually because I will get paranoid about it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, I have PTSD. Pussy that's so delicious. <laughs> is a shirt that I saw once. <laughs> that's perfect. Amazing. Sometimes I forget, like, oh yeah, pal, you're disabled. Like, you're you're allowed to like ask for help and stuff like that. Well, my brain goes, you pussy, motherfucker, you can't. I I forget. You literally have a service dog, pal. Like, you're that fucked up. Aww. Relax. <laughs> She's a sweetheart. She's super cute. Can I see a picture? Of course. My parents gave her a mohawk recently. Yeah. Oh, Banjo, where are you going out there? Wait, I, I saw something. Her name is Pancake. Pancake! Because she does a little flop thing where her little back legs are flopped back. Oh, she sploots! Sploot. Yeah, she sploots! That's one of my favorite words. I'm, I'm just, like, avoiding saying all of the weird slang that I know now because I'm like, what if it's, like, bricked up? <laughs> what if I'm saying, like, my dog's bricked up? <laughs> no, I can't fucking do that. Oh my god. This is, I think, tale any more coherent. No. Oh, you gotta... Snail, get out of here. Yeah. Wait, uh, there we I go. Just... It's uploaded. Oh. Yay! Oh, 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 baby. She's a golden doodle. I would not recommend the poodle mix, honestly. Uh, no. Um, the worst part about... I'm, I'm gonna go on a little tangent. 
cool mixes are unethical. I didn't know this at the time. I thought they were the best thing ever because I'm like, oh my god. No shedding and uh, temperament from the other dog. No, you get a mixed bag and you don't know what the fuck you're getting. You could have like the horrible hair of a poodle and the shedding of a fucking husky or something like that. Yeah, I had a, a, a go redo of myself, and she was, like, very unhealthy. The poor thing. Go doodles tend to have, like, a lot of weight problems. Like, more so than other breeds for some reason. Wow. And a lot of times you don't know that your dog is getting overweight because they're so fluffy. You can't see it. <laughs> trying to think about how, how can I make this gun tail more appealing. Uh, I was gonna say earlier that I still sometimes get that, like, RS RSD thing. Yeah. Uh, but, like, it's more manageable now. Uh, I think, honestly, the only time it really comes into effect is when I, like, I see you streaming and I'm like, I could jump into that voice chat call, but then, like, there's that part of my, like, the back of my mind that's just like, yeah, but then everyone will fucking hate you for jumping into the stream call no. again. And no. I'm just like, no, you, no, you shut the fuck really up. No, you're really funny, and I really <laughs> like your laugh. I enjoy having you on here every time. Thank you. Yeah, I, that's that's the things that I need to keep reminding myself when it comes to stuff like that, but it that thankfully... It's only in like that and other like similar circumstances that I feel that way. Otherwise, I'm I'm able to manage it a lot better these days. Yeah. I cream help to any Digimon have gun tails that I can just rip from. <laughs> uh, I think there is one of the like the Greymon that you use that have a mechanized tail that is vaguely enough like a gun tail that you could use. Well, it just it just cuts off at the chin. Oh my oh, god, the fucking, here. uh, the caption oh. said, yeah, I cream help. What's that? <laughs> it said what? I took a screenshot for you. Oh, thank you. I apparently had symmetry on at one point when I should have. I fixed it. Yeah, it just, it's just like a metal cap over the tip. There's not, like... Hmm. A lot of wiggle room to make it gun. Yeah. Unless I just um, cut the tip off and leave a hole that is just indicative of where the bullets come out. I would recommend looking up like minigun turrets because they have that similar configuration of like the multiple barrels together. Uh, there's also Machine Dramon that we saw in that episode of the. Uh, of Adventure colon that like the laser shot out from different parts of it. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you know what the worst RSD thing is ever? What? When somebody asks you for help and then tells you your help is shitty. Oh no. Ah, like an alarm it scared me. No, your alarm. <laughs> I'll have moments where I don't realize I'm doing a behavior that is off-putting, uh, and like nobody will tell me for months, and then people get mad at me about it and then tell me, and I'm like, well, gee, I had no idea. <laughs> oh no. Hey, would you mind telling me things like a normal person? Hey, you're a normal person, right? Say something. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I tend to have, like, whenever I introduce myself to a person or a new group of people uh, that I know I have to spend extended time with, I usually try to, like, throw in something like, yeah, and just so you know, if I do something that, like, makes you uncomfortable, please tell me because I literally would rather you tell me than have you sit there in, like, quiet awkwardness and discomfort. It, it does not hurt you to have me learn something that could help like, that could better myself and help you personally. Yeah. 
Uh, also, I'm gonna post a Digimon that does have a, a gun tail in the uh, collab chat for you. Oh, yeah, a little mini gun. Well, yeah, but it's not like I'm a long tail. Oh, what, uh, <laughs> what the fuck, Fluffs? Oh, no. I kind of want want to make one of these with the bowl. Yeah, but please, please do. Anytime <laughs> I finish, I want to make something funny with the bowl. I will never tell you not to do it. Oh my god, yes. Oh. I'm just fucking getting crushed. Oh my, my god, no. <laughs> It'll my... be my new chalk sprite. Camille getting... <laughs> I'll make a really long gif. Where, oh, where like... <laughs> where like it spans from the top of the thing to the bottom. And it's just Camille getting crushed whenever we speak. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. I'm just a giant hydraulic press. I got another one here, Bull, don't worry. Okay. Also, my There's like was a lot of me about a TikTok you saw the other day where somebody was expressing, like, um, an autistic thing that they deal with, where the situation was two people. Uh, one of them is autistic, the other one isn't. And the other person said, is, is like acting all huffy, and the autistic person is like, are you angry about something? And the uh, non autistic person is like, no. And the non autistic person is like, okay, I'm going to take you at face value and believe you because why wouldn't I? <laughs> mm -hmm. and, and then, like, time goes by, the person's like, aren't you gonna ask if I'm okay? And the non autistic person's like, you said you were fine. And they're like, well, I'm obviously not. And we're like, the non autistic person's like, no. no, it's not obvious, actually. It's not. <laughs> And then they're like, what are you mad about? And the person's like, you should know. And, I, and the autistic person's oh, like, you should know! I'm like, no, I fucking don't! I can't read your mind! I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. And I hate, like, sensing that somebody might be mad at me about something and then be like, like, how do I even address it? Because I don't know what they're mad about! And I can also just be misreading something! Oh no. I want you two to know that whenever yeah. anything makes me upset, don't worry, I'm gonna bitch about it to you in the most <laughs> kind way possible. Yeah. I'm also I'm I literally have no fear of confrontation, so if something makes that I will say something immediately. <laughs> cool. Uh also here. I I wanted to wait until you finish the story before distracting yeah. you with Digimon. Okay, here you go. <laughs> You son of a goddamn bitch! Fucking got what? him! Get the fuck out of my what? street! <laughs> don't actually. <laughs> oh, yeah. What is it? I don't get it! You don't need to. Oh, uh, actually, no, you do. I'll explain it. Oh, uh, that's Mimon. Oh, uh, he's horrible. And useless and annoying and only there for like pointless comedic relief in the show that he's in. And yeah. <laughs> he and Pokemon both. There was like a zoom in shot of him making this face at one point and like it sent us into hysterics. <laughs> and like I made a funny video about us sending that picture back and forth. Uh, <laughs> and every now and then he'll just send it to me and it pisses me off every time. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> How could you do this to me in my time of need when I'm at my weakest? <laughs> <laughs> when he's so vulnerable and breathable. I'm, I'm so vulnerable. Vulnerable. <laughs> I don't breedable. regret it. After that, I don't regret it. I have no regrets about doing it, actually. And I will do it again. <laughs> I know you will, and I'm, I'm so glad that of all hand gestures to understand, my camera understands middle finger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christ. Oh my god, wow. Fuck oh, <laughs> I, I couldn't not, is the thing. <laughs> it was beautiful. I'm like, did you interrupt my rant there to do that? Because I would have started screaming. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I wanted to wait, especially. Oh, oh my god.
got to put this picture of me while on stream. Yeah. There you go. Alright. Uh, this one also isn't, like, the kind of tail that you're looking for, but it does technically have a gun tail. Well, that's a lot closer to what I need. It's at least, like, on a tail. Yeah, it... There's not, surprisingly, not a lot of, like, Digimon that distinctly are known for having, like, tail gun. Yeah. I might just have to get funky with it. Because they usually just have a gun gun. <laughs> yeah, they have... They've they got guns in their chest, in their shoulders, in their face. In their dick. Yeah, they got... They have guns in their chest that shoot missiles that have teeth. Yes. I I I love those teeth missiles that Metal Greymon shoots out. They're my favorite. They're nice. Yeah. I'm put Meemon in the corner here. <laughs> you can hang out. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I have a video of, like, people using increasingly larger pets to wipe their eyes of tears, and the last one in the video is this man picking up a giant hog, and the hog screaming the entire time, like, low- Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, they don't like the entire time. <laughs> Let me find this. To share it in chat. Oh my god. That looks like my friend Zareen, that's a little scary. That's me. Cream, cream, my gift is me with Vinylon! <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. How have I introduced you to Vinylon? To what? Vinylon. Vinylon. Yeah. Uh, was it the. the, the... <laughs> I've what? Tried it before. Yes, this is. Well, you need to look at to look at it again. This is the game, so we can't get out of this. There he is. There he is. There he is. He's under a foot tall. I can grab him and throw him. What a fucking creature. He's my favorite horrible creature. He's everything to me. I want to be him. <laughs> I found one where somebody's wiping their eyes with a kinkajou. <sighs> oh my god. Oh, there's a Digimon named Jazzamon. I don't like jazz. Maybe. Whenever I type Twitch into my search bar, it immediately pulls up the whole stream. That's how often I come in. <laughs> I love the duality of you being like the balls. balls. That that came in at right at the perfect time. The duality of me being balls. Yeah, sometimes you're right ball, sometimes you're left ball. <laughs> it's a left ball card to me. God. <laughs> I was gonna say, I love the duality of you being, of, like, me going, my, my lion is very large, and then you, I'm bigger, and then also, you being like, Vilemon is under a foot tall, and I wish I was him. <laughs> <laughs> I contain multitudes. Yeah, truly. Listen, I, I need to, like, someday find, make, like, a comprehensive list of characters I felt deep by gender connection to, and it will be so vast. Oh, dude, I remember this, like, art meme going around on Twitter where people were, like, posting, a, a like, a collage of, uh, characters they either really like, or characters with aesthetics they really like, and then drawing an OC based on, like, all the, the different, like, common traits from them, and then you should do something like that. I might. 
Yeah, yeah, I'll do it too. You can be fine. It would be kind of hard though. Okay. Yeah. yeah. yeah I'm gonna make a day out of it. Um. <laughs> so my free my gender things are like vampire, vilebond, fish. Yeah. And then there's like wild cards in there, like um, uh, sigilith for Pokemon. Yeah. My character, my character would be very be not afraid in an Elder's Horror at the same time. Your character would just be the kind of character that, like... Your character would be the representation of masking, where in public they're just, like, a Lugosi... Bella Lugosi <laughs> vampire, like, well put together, and then they, like, they remove the cape and reveal that they're a Be Not Afraid Eldritch Horror. They're a little freak. Yeah. so correct. I wish I could mask, like, Bella Lugosi, though. Do you have any idea what I would give to look like that man? <laughs> he, he's barely masking, let's be real though, the way he acts. Oh no, his, his stare, the stare he gives is just autism. <laughs> yeah. The three genders. Vampire, oh my god. Vampire, Vilemon, and Fish. Vampire, Vilemon, and Fish. Vampire, Vilemon, and Fish. <laughs> Tag yourself on Fish. I'm Vampire, I guess? I'm all three. <laughs> I, I, I can't. That <laughs> Your gender. Your gender. You are the gender. I there's like um most of my gender connections are very in human things. The only time I've ever looked at a real human and being thought like, wow, me. Um, <laughs> Bella Lugosi a little bit, but he's more of an attraction than a gender. Yeah. Um, uh, the guy who plays Redfield, White Fry. I latched yeah. onto him so hard, and I, I could not possibly explain it to anybody. <laughs> <laughs> the things he did to my mental illness made it worse. <laughs> At least yours is like a mixed bag. Mine is both predictable and almost a bit embarrassing <laughs> with some of them. <laughs> with some, like, Cause you'll get like the very obvious. Oh yeah, of course that was your gender. Like like Bowser, of course Bowser is your gender. And then you'll get ones that are just like they're obvious in retrospect, but like in the moment they're like, what the fuck? That's your gender. And it'll be things like fucking Spike the dog from Tom and Jerry. You said that to me once, and it, like I see it so completely. <laughs> yeah, but like, <laughs> but, but like in in retrospect. Yeah, it does make perfect sense, but like in the moment, it's like that's your fucking gender, that dog from that cartoon. Oh, oh god, the jersey really came out when I said dog just then. Dog. I, I dog. Have a that you might like cream. Um, yeah. I, when I was looking for my little mini shirt and pixel here, which is from Maple Story, I was checking my Maple Story reference folder when it wasn't in there, but I did see a character that I almost forgot about. Um, this guy is like the protector of any town of you people. Um, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Please look faster and I beg you. There he is. I got him. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> You're correct. Yes, he's very nice and very sweet, and I like him a lot, and he's just Leomon, but he doesn't die. Yay! I love when Leomon doesn't die. Um, there's also a, um, enemy boss that's a lion man. There you go. <laughs> that's the same guy we just saw. No, they're actually very different, I promise. Fair enough, but yeah, they're both- they're both- they're both my gender. Yeah, they are- they are legitimately very close in design. Um... Yeah. I'm trying to see if I have, like, his full body rough. Yeah, your- your- your mask is, uh, Dracula, with your, like, reveal being do not- be not afraid. Mine is, uh, like, goofball dad energy with- as my mask, and then my reveal is fucking monster. 
<laughs> Be big beast man. I posted a gif of what my gender is. <laughs> not like monster affectionate, not monster derogatory. Oh my god. I can't believe you're a fucking scallop. Oh my god. I'm not a fucking scallop. It's very clamplica cam cl complicated. <laughs> you couldn't even get the pun out. You couldn't do it. I, I'm sorry. Here's, here's his uh, this guy's actual, like, sprite work for when you find him. Guy, like, speaking Spanish the entire day and then, like, popping into a chat and switching to English. It sucks. <laughs> You're so fucking valid. But you also chose this. <laughs> I- I- No. I- I- I was obligated here at- At horn point. The bull is holding me hostage. Oh, oh yep. Yeah. That's also gender. The fucking- The- The king- Like, wear loop guy in, uh, Neopets the Darkest Fairy. Also gender. Nice. Oh, also, um, this guy right here is, like, a wear lion. Um, yeah. His, his human form's handsome, but I don't think it would fit your vibe. No, this one is more my vibe. Yeah. <laughs> this one. Whoops. <laughs> my OCs are my gender. So am I. Me too. I'm procrastinating dealing with the gun tail. That you're so valid. Here, the the uh, weird lion guy is like tired and grizzled, so I will show him because I like him. Yeah. Oh no, absolutely not. <laughs> I do have a friend who would look at this guy and would be like attracted to him. Um, if I showed this picture to him, he would be like eyes emoji, but nice. I. I look at this man and I'm like, get this, get this fucking eraser head Aizawa bait out of here. <laughs> Have you guys seen the Baldur's Gate 3 goblins? No. Here, here, I'll, I'll post an image. I'll post a link to some of the uh, art for the game. So yeah. that people can see what I'm talking about. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, I I like I like being like big, scary-looking monster that looks intimidating, but is also actually just like very comforting. Complicated. <laughs> there we go. I posted it. Um, I'm, I'm, I just recently joined a Pathfinder game, and I'm gonna try to make a goblin character. What is it posted? Based on those goblins, because I hate the Pathfinder goblins. They're so fucking ugly. They've got like basketball, not basketball heads. They've got uh, football heads. Like Ar Arnold. Donde está la pintura? Okay. The picture. Where did you post it? What what picture? The goblin. The goblin. Yeah. No, no, no. I posted. I'm gonna. Be, I'm gonna. I just came up with a character today. I'm gonna base them off the goblins I just posted in in stream chat. Oh, oh! In stream chat is where you posted. That's where we're asking. That that's why I was asking. Where was the link posted to? I Here, got it. I understand. I got it. I got it. Yeah, yeah. I see yeah. it so I wow. like that these goblins are ugly, but they look nice. Yeah. But the the fucking Pathfinder ones, I'm gonna kill. Did <laughs> I just make it like a cannon too? Just make it a two at the end. Like a, two. Like a fire hose? Yes! I 
I will return in a moment. I must go eat. I forgot to. Yay. Enjoy. This girl looks so bad. That's definitely on there, isn't it? Mmm. That's true is on there. Yeah. Maybe maybe make the tail shorter? Would that help? Because, like, you have a lot of length to work with right now, maybe shortening it would, like... Oh, Are you ghost-handing? Oh. Am I what? Oh, I thought you were ghost-handing. No, that's my hand up. Oh, okay. I'm holding my face in thought. I have one hand up, though, so I don't know why two... Two are there. <laughs> I'm gonna do something funny. See how it looks. Wow! Yeah! Tube! That's, his tail just cuts off and there's a cannon. <laughs> Tubular! Oh my god. Fucking tube. The worst thing is I don't hate that. But it doesn't look as good as it could. Yeah. And if I just leave it by like, cut off at the tip, but there's a hole there. That's where bullets come out. Yeah. of Satan. Right, time to lie on the tail. I don't think I do. I don't. I'm turning stream avatars off for a second. This is the most important thing ever. I have to search this. Hey, you're good. Shit. 
tragic. But not unexpected. Well, I mean, if the entire cast of Frontiers exists, I don't know why Mimon wouldn't be really easy to make. Because the other, because the cast of Frontiers is probably visually more appealing than Nemon is. Maybe, maybe, but there's like baby Digimon on here. Is there Bokomon? Oh, Bokomon. Oh, I might have to close and reopen stream avatars, it's freaking out. Oh no. You can't see it on stream, thankfully, but it's like flashing every flashing white every few seconds. Yeah, I'm closing stream avatars, I'll open it again. Dude, I love Digimon. <laughs> I love Digimon too. And I don't want to look for Pokemon because I at least like looking at Nemon. <laughs> Nemon sparks joy. Fair. But not to whoever is making those stream avatars, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. Some of the- oh my god, it's still doing it. Well, at least you can't see it on stream. I don't know why it's angry. Because you're looking for Nemon, I guess. I guess. Um, I learned that some of these, uh, sprites are just from the vinyl bracelets. Yeah. So, I guess Nemon is again one of those. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. He doesn't have any canon evolutions, so why would he be in one? Mhm. Mm if one day I came out with canon evolutions for Neemon and Pokemon, I think I would just... I think I would just start screaming. What if they were, like, really, really cool? I, I think I would just start screaming. <laughs> We should do that sometime. We should do some fan-made evolutions for them. I think there is one fan-made evolution for Nemon specifically. I saw a fan-made evolution for um, Bilemon. That was pretty good. Mm -hmm. But I prefer Skull Saitamon. There. Hey, did you know it's past midnight and war is still streaming? What is he doing? Past midnight? Oh shit. Like, granted, he's an hour behind us. Dude, yeah, I didn't even know it was. Asleep. 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 I had no idea it was past midnight, to be honest. <laughs> it's not I don't know if I'm actually gonna finish this anymore today. Probably not. Probably. I'll at least finish the tale. I can definitely finish it tomorrow. Somewhere. What if I just put that on my stream somewhere? Like, like just kept it floating in the background? Yeah, like where, where I had, um, Sherman earlier. Sherman was attached to my little chat box. Superimpose it over one of the skulls. I will. Let me find Nemon.
perfect. Save again in a second. <laughs> My god. Transparent Nemon jump scare. I'm just gonna have him like standing on top of this one. Nobody's gonna ever see him. <laughs> like, I can see him. I know he's there. <laughs> He's in such like an out of the way spot and his colors almost blend in with the frame. Oh my god, yeah. He is perfect right there. <laughs> so for that tail, do you want it to just maintain a like a long, sleek design? I guess. I was gonna say you could just add like chunks and segmented parts on it. But like this the this whole time you've kinda of kept it like in the same sleek design like it was now, so I figured, oh I guess I guess they must be doing that intentionally. So I, that's well, why I was having a hard time finding like I tried to add a barrel to it, it just didn't look good. Hmm. If I just... Well, do you want it to be like a gun gun or like a laser gun? A gun. Okay, I understand. <laughs> I think I'll start streaming early in the day tomorrow if I'm not feeling too sick. Watch Pokemon give birth. Yeah, I don't like that either. <laughs> in fact, I don't like. Right in fact, I don't like that they made us watch Pokemon. <laughs> You're so valid. I still don't understand the purpose of their existence, because even if they're meant to just be comedic relief, the key word of that is comedic, and they are not. Except for that one face Nemon dude. Except for that one face Nemon dude. That's the only gift that Nemon and Pokemon have given me. Yep.
I honestly completely forgot that they made a show that they showed us Pokemon giving birth because I guess I blocked it out of my memory. It, it was traumatic. <laughs> yeah. Pokemon birth trauma. Why would they do that? Why would they do that? For anybody to not know in the context, you don't need to know. I don't understand why that Patamon was born with a belly band, too, because that implies that that was an inherited Pokemon who did not give birth to Patamon! No, he didn't. So why did that Patamon have a belly band? Don't think too hard about it. I hate it. At least it looked cute on him. It did, but like... I know where it- I know who it belongs to. I know where that's been. I know where that's been. Also, I'll never not be angry at the fact that like, the entire... The entire history of the digital world in that show is like... Beast Digimon versus Humanoid Digimon, and then they made peace, and then the leader of the Beast Digimon, like, became corrupted with power and led a revolt, and that didn't somehow spark another, like, another, like, Beast Human, like, Beast Digimon versus Human Digimon war again, like it had initially done. Yeah, I thought there would be some ongoing resentment about that, and there was none. Yeah, in fact, it was literally never brought up outside of just, like, the history of the world to explain... I don't know why those three are in charge. The potential that so had, and the lack of any usage of its material pisses me off so much. Yeah, like, you could literally just throw in any lore reason for why, like, Seraphimon, Ophanimon, and Cherubimon are the leaders, and it would still matter just as much. Yep. I have to point to his tail and say it's a gun. Yeah. Bullets you know, come from there. You know what also really annoys me, or what baffles me, is that the entire time that show has gone on, they have had access to go back to the human world at any time, freely! Yeah, the trains just didn't let them. <laughs> like, it didn't let them up until the, like, near end when everything's getting destroyed and suddenly the Trailmon were more happy to oblige with yep. moving people around freely. But it, even then, it's like, if, if the ability to travel between human and digital world has been possible, and like, there's nothing saying any Digimon that isn't Trailmon could, like, get to that station. Like, if you can fly, there's nothing saying that a Digimon that can fly can't, like, make it all the way to that station with their own two wings. So then, wouldn't a good idea for a plot point be, Hey, wait, if we can go back to the human world from the digital world time, doesn't that mean Digimon could also make it to the human world? Uh-oh! Yeah, they didn't put any roadblocks in place to say that wasn't a possibility. Literally, the only roadblock they put was that Bokomon, who never read his a book, like, canonically has not read the entirety of his book, even, has just said, no, in the book, it says that human and, or, like, Digimon can't go to the human world because it would cause chaos and the world would be destroyed. But literally, all that, it's just the book that says that, and there's no actual... It's too Yeah. So what the fuck? I don't understand. I don't understand that show. I don't understand it, Bull. We don't need to. It's okay. It's okay. It can't hurt you anymore. <laughs> Pokemon giving birth isn't real. It can't hurt you. That's fine, that wasn't the thing I was ever thinking of that would hurt me anyway. 
that, that's your trauma. I have different trauma from this show. You know what is real? What? I stab you one. <laughs> Which one? Whichever one you want, baby. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna finish this tail and then I'll be done for the night. After that, yeah. I've Like, everyone's just not going to the digital world because they all just said, they all just said, we promise we won't, or go to the human world because they're all just like, we promise we won't go to the human world, and everyone took their word on it. Stupid. And then there was, like, um, those fun villains at the end of the series that we really liked. And they're like, we want to go to the human world. I'm like, why don't you just go? Just go! Do the trail yeah. stop! Like, like they the they say that they didn't go because they wanted the power to get there and take over it, but like, again, the Trailmon go there freely back and forth to that station, like, on the regular, and also they're Digimon. Like, what power do they think humans have? Like, you can't even say oh humans have guns because Digimon also have guns and they shoot each other with like no armor on and are like ow that that felt like someone threw a pebble at me really hard and it's fine did you want to have nukes did you want to have nukes like literally that one guy went feral for a second and destroyed everything yeah what do they think humans are going to be capable of literally nothing they don't do on a regular basis i don't understand i don't understand the entire show falls apart if you start asking any question at yeah. all, ever. If I ever meet the people who wrote that show, I don't think they're gonna survive the encounter in Minecraft. No. In Minecraft, yeah. The first thing I'll ask is, why the fuck did you do that to Zoe? You fucking creep, yeah, she's, she's going to jail. She's yeah, she's in sixth grade, dog. Oh me. Ten thousand years jail right now. She's in sixth grade and she's the only girl on the team. Hey, why the fuck did you make her the only girl on the team? Like, that's Why can't Tommy be? Itself, but the fact that she's the only girl and written like that. Yeah. <laughs> Cause like, I'm sure the defense is gonna be, oh, of the ten legendary warriors, two girls, and it's like, yeah, of the five on the good guy side and the five on the bad guy, there's one on each side. You know what they could have done that would have been very brave? Yeah. And I would do it in a remake. I would have, um, had one of the human kids that turn into a warrior have their warrior be male and the, the child be a girl. Oh my god, yeah. But like, the, uh, 
And they'll like make one offhand comment about it, and then never bring it up again. Yeah. <laughs> or, or even, here, here's a, a fucking thing to throw at you, because I, it truly does not matter as much. Make one of the pre-existing characters that's already a boy into a girl. Yep. Like, make either Tommy or Koji a girl. You want to know why I would incorporate that into a modern remake as well that's also gender related? Um, it would be cool if they touched on, like, a person. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, Lord. You fucking got me. Hi, Lore. Hi, everybody. Well, Lore. Welcome Raiders, we're talking about how much we hate Digimon Frontier. <laughs> oh shit, this raid comes with lore? <laughs> um, before I get back to what I was saying, I'll um, show lore when I finish today. So we got the... <laughs> we got the okay. side view here, with his Godzilla spikes and uh, the tail, which is almost finished. I do. I've got, I've got, uh, fluffs on my head. Um... Yippee! Yippee! Thank you, young pup, for the follow. Um, I also have... This way. I have this on my shoulder, which is supposed to be shirted. Um... And I also fixed a few things with the back view. I still have to add the, um, spikes to the back view. But that's also been shaded. Thank you for the follow as a face crown. Thank you for following. Yeah. Are you crying so hard right now? I don't believe you. Things are getting happen. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was I was saying um regarding kids being turn being able to turn into Digimon. I remember telling you at one point, if I were able to do that, I would do everything in my power to never turn back into a human. Hmm. And I think they should have touched on that. Yeah, there's definitely a lot to talk on, especially because even though, like, the entire idea of it is they eventually learn what it means on which had never been a question that had been brought up prior, so I don't no. know why that was such an important point. But, like, especially considering they're legendary warriors, I would have thought that would have been the thing first, but anyway, uh, I feel like there definitely should have been tighter rules about, you know, either becoming a Digimon in that world, or at the very least just some a little more, like, engaging than just, and now the human can turn to a Digimon sometimes when they want to. On uh, at will, with apparently zero limitations unless they get hit really hard. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, if yeah. anyone- if no one here had- oh, sorry. No, I was just- just saying I hate it. <laughs> yeah, if no one here has seen Digimon Frontiers, it's, uh... <laughs> just I don't recommend watching it, even with the English dub, realistically. But it is a good, bad watch if yeah. you want to make fun of it. It is really fun to make fun of. Like, I've, I haven't laughed that hard in forever. <laughs> yeah, because then you'll get- you'll get some great liners, like, uh... So he made a mistake, what are you going to do, take his bowling shoes away? <laughs> or, man, he's, he sucks. Or, what, what was it for the jerky one? Oh, it's like, I'm beef and he's the jerky. <laughs> oh, that show is so terrible. It's so terrible. Like, it, 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 it lives in my brain in such a wide space that I fear I'm gonna make a video essay about it. It lives in my brain in such a space that I... I honestly wouldn't mind making a video essay about it. <laughs> Let's go out on a video essay right now. <laughs> I'll bet. I'll do it. Fuck. Let's go. You think I don't have so many thoughts about Digimon all the time? <laughs> <laughs> Lore, send me pictures. Oh, you were at 
could be DMing me right now, actually. Oh, you sent me. Uh, <laughs> you sent me a pawn. <laughs> there. There's there the proof. He, he, there he sent receipts. I believe him. <laughs> oh man, he's pogging so hard. He did it. He did it for real. For real, for real. Wow. Yeah, send me, uh, send me a screenshot, send me a dragon board. And some water. Get you some water. Everyone hydrate and stretch. Yes. Hey, everyone, posture check. Posture check. Hydrate, stretch, everything. Everyone, check your apps. There are eligible dragonborn in your area. <laughs> this looks great. I like oh. the shapes. Beautiful, beautiful. Fantastic job. Everybody should follow more. I forget I have to do shout out so we should on that did it. Hey no. Hey look, he's bigger now. Whenever you do a shout out for somebody who's in the Twitch chat and makes their little stream app jar grow big and it's really cute. Aww. It's beautiful glory, you should be very proud. Oh, we got two war gray mods. Yeah, they're gonna fight for dominance. <laughs> war gray mod. Ooh, that's a good. That looks like a good shade of purple until I realized. Oh wait, that's blue. <laughs> yeah, that's that's my select tool. It's okay. Sometimes oh, we it's a select tool, uh, make something look a certain way, and I'm like, that's kind of neat, and then I never do anything about it. <laughs> what if you did something about it? What if I just fell over and passed out right now? You have a button for that. I forget which one it is. <laughs> oh, it's out. It's, it's Makes sense. <laughs> and... Down they go. Ooh, wait, that looks really good. Actually, Laura, can you just make it look like that? Can you just <laughs> forego all the reds and just make it this black and yellow? <laughs> yes, black, more gray, 
Yeah! <laughs> Lord <laughs> Raymond. Alright, I think that's all I can reasonably get done today. I am really close to being finished with this. It's your turn. Hi, you came back just when you started laying down. You got me already. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Spent too long cooking. What'd you make? I didn't actually cook. I went to go talk with my grandma. I just put a uh, granola on a on a yogurt. Oh. <laughs> Lord, it's not that deep. Don't make it weird. Yeah, Wait, did I make it weird? weird? We can make it weird in a different way and talk about, um, house pussy disease. <laughs> Wait, no. Don't make it- don't make it weird, also because this isn't a human, this is a fucking dino man. It's dragon. a Digimon. It's a Digimon? Alright, I'm gonna save, and my computer's gonna hate it. Digital blackface? What? What did I miss? Don't worry about it. Laura's supposed to cringe. Yeah. Alright, it's safe. We're safe. We're safe. Okay, he is a man. But still, don't make it weird. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is a man with manly urges. That is a whole man right there. <laughs> This man can get bricked up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I want to see. full of yogurt. I have. almost had it all over my tablet. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Before we move screens, I want to see if Laura can find our Easter egg that I put on the screen. Yay. Oh, okay. Pow, Pow has to find it too because Pow doesn't yes. know. Pow isn't here. I don't know what. Um, I've added something to my stream layout. And you need to find it. It's not it's not in the stream avatars. A bunny? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I wanna see if Lore can find it. Lore, can you find what I'm <laughs> <laughs> Can you find what bull hid in the stream layout? Not over there! <laughs> not over there. No, that's not oh, it. Buddy. Yeah, I know. Lord, did you actually see him though? <laughs> Is it something this far? <laughs> Is it the best spot? <laughs> Lord, please tell me you see him. <laughs> please, I'm shaking your shoulders. <laughs> I need to like comb, like quickly comb through uh, Frontier to get um, a shit ton of voice lines from that little shit. <laughs> oh, it's not, it's not on the drawing. It's part of my stream layout. Here, it's on the layout. It's on the area outside of the canvas. It's no, not... there was an Among Us hidden in one of the highlights. <laughs> like There's an Among Us hidden in the eyes. That's how Bull draws eyes. <laughs> Oh, that's such a funny drawing meme. I love the book, the secret of all this. Yeah. <laughs> There's only so much on my stream layout. There's only so many places you can look. <laughs> Do you see him? Do you see him? He is so important. I got a bongo cat commission and they asked me to put, give it pupils. And I hate it. Does it look very unsettling? What? <laughs> <laughs> take a peek. I have to tap it. Oh, it does. <laughs> it's still good though. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. It's staring into your soul. <laughs> you have beautiful eyes.
I think Laura. Sorry, noticed. what does the money have to do with my 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 endless pussy disease or something like that? What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> endless pussy. Hey, Laura, do you want to do you want to uh, check your directions again, real quick? Hey, <laughs> tell me about what? What? <laughs> I I am never gonna let you live this down. Oh no! Laura, I am never gonna let you live this down. Did you do? Live what down? <laughs> you what did I miss? Oh but it's on the right skull. You think I was right, Laura? Please stop. You're tired and hungry. Me too. Fix your thumbs. Laura, are you? Hey, Laura, I can. I can help give you an out. Laura, are you left-handed? Are you left-handed? I'm just talking about you. Are you dyslexic? Are you left-handed and or dyslexic? Diagnose yourself on chat right now. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> no, I can't no. help you then. Sorry. <laughs> you deserve every bit of this. Then. <laughs> People who are left-handed can easily get left and right mixed up, since right tends to be the more dominant hand. So <laughs> that could have been your out, but unfortunately, you have no. <laughs> Thank you for sharing. Thank you for sharing for sharing your your left handedness. Yeah. Um, hey. I, I need to put Nimon on. You truly are the the, the oppressed. The I'm oppressed, also uh, left minority. Yeah, I'm also left handed, so I have that solidarity. <laughs> I'm on the throne! Yeah! Yeah! Alright, I'll put myself on the <laughs> oh, did you see what it looked like? Yeah, I did! <laughs> what did you, what happened? <laughs> when you shrank yourself down, your pelvic area was directly behind Pow as, <laughs> as Pow was bent over. Yeah! Yeah! How do I do it in that angle again? I don't actually know. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? <laughs> You didn't have it in angle, it's just a size. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this I hate this. I hate I'm this. Right now. <laughs> I I I I have to turn my PNG around. <laughs> I can't look at that. that. Hold on. I can actually do that. Well you're not doing it anymore, so I don't need to. <laughs> just don't your eyes, you don't look at me anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why are my hands up? Dude, what were you doing? You were doing the shocker, dog. You were doing the shocker, dude. I've had so many ghost hands during this stream. That one was a really specific one and very appropriate for the <laughs> oh, Nimon. He just scared the shit out of me. I forgot he was that large. <laughs> Dude. You're in front of the camera. There you go. There you go. My hand is not up. Stop doing that. Oh. Ghost hand supreme. <laughs> that, <laughs> that, is, that is the Nimon from Adventure 20. By the way, it has the deep voice. <laughs> it was the nicer picture I could find. I yeah, didn't like what? something I didn't like looking at. Yeah, <laughs> because that picture is nice. That's the one with the uh, with the pleasant voice to listen to. <laughs> yes. Oh, I should explain Ooh, right why he's even here. <laughs> I just I clowned on Lord and forgot what the point was. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? There, there's a point to clowning on lore? <laughs> lore, I love you now, I love you I know I'm, I'm bullying you out of, uh, out of affection. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, Cream and I have a strong vendetta against Digimon Frontier, and 
Nimon is like a love-hate relationship. But like he's endearing enough for Nidawan to put him on this for Nidawan to put him on the stream. Yeah, he is less insufferable than Pokemon is, because he is truly just there to vibe, and I respect that at the very least. Yeah. It's like why are you doing this? I don't know! And then you're like, sure. Alright. <laughs> on your throne. I I better count at least four of them when I did that model. Ooh, ooh, can you put a can you put the like the stussy S on the throne? Oh yes, please put that on there somewhere. Put it put it on the bottom of the throne, so if I rotate it unnaturally it'll show up. How what is that emoji? Uh <laughs> it's a slug throwing a slug at you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you not know the the you not no, wait, go back over to the canvas. Go back over to the drawing I'm canvas. I'm I'm I get to do something I've not done since Oh my god. <gasps> I just got an idea. Hold on. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. This is chaotic. This is chaotic. <laughs> I, I made this for a friend. Um I'm gonna keep myself this large too. I'm gonna do it over here, it's fine. More pay close attention. I know you know what this is. Everybody knows what this is. Yeah, you probably have seen it, but have never heard the name of it. Are you making loss? No! No! <laughs> no! no wait, oh, wait, the, you're, you're doing, like, the S thing. Yes. Yes. I've never seen it done, and nobody would show me how to do it. Oh, that's so sad. Lord, you got you got to Where's my hand? You gotta put one, one of these on my phone somewhere. Lord, if you don't know what this is, I don't believe you. There, there we go! Yay! It, it comes with many names, so if uh, if you don't know it by Stussy, you probably know it by Superman S. Even though it's not a Superman S, that's just what people call it. <laughs> oh man, you drew it so clean, too. Thank you! I had a moment where I'm like, do I remember how to do this? And I'm like, of course I do, it's human nature. <laughs> I know, I know exactly what my next drawing is gonna be. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna make the bull throwing a brick. Oh At good! The <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> do you know that picture of Eminem throwing a rat? <laughs> Do you know it? <laughs> yes, it says, Whoa, rat, oh, plague be upon ye. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, I, this one I don't know, but I also I don't know most. Oh, this is, this is the learning experience. Oh, this is the learning experience. <laughs> Oh, we're going back over here for this one, because I put it on the screen. Oh my god. That was per- there. that explosion was perfectly timed with me ripping the worst ass possible. <laughs> Dude. What the fuck? You can't rip ass on stream like that. <laughs> I'm so glad I have sound cancellation on. Do you see it? Oh my god. <laughs> I see it. I need to draw Fritz as this. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna send that in our chat and I'm gonna be like, this was Fritz. God, I've gone back and forth so many times. Also, Cow's really just floating here and I have not moved him. Yeah. You're where you were when you were stuck in my room. <laughs> it's okay, keep me there, I'll be sucking on your boob next stream. Great. <laughs> Nobody needs context for that. This is the, I am the best Twitch streamer ever. <laughs> You're so good, you don't even need to do plugs. <laughs> nope. So they know where to find you and us. Nope. <laughs> You can find me underneath the bridge at midnight. Um, 
The one by the Costco. You can find me, uh... Like... Eating, I guess. <laughs> yeah, they're at the Costco eating the, the hot dogs. I, I'm at the Costco, I'm getting every free sample, I'm shoving everyone out of the way, and... If you see a large lion man with, like, no less than 12 boxes of those uh, pizza cupcake things that you can put in the oven, you, that's me. Oh, the little deep dish pizza? Yeah! I want those! Those things so are so good, good with a little yeah. pepperoni in them. Do y'all see what those hands happening right now? Yeah. My hands yeah. are down. What are you doing? Stop! <laughs> what? I did my first dish Oh, what, what are you measuring? I uh, somebody's dick. What? Whoa. Why is it still happening? Stop! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, put me where the hand would go up. I can find you. Dude, oh my god, it just keeps going. Is that even TOS appropriate? That's <laughs> for where you can find me off the street. That's me in the corner. That's me in the spot. Like. <laughs> Who's in my religion? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pass it out. <laughs> <laughs> I need to find something to be right now. Yeah. Uh, uh, also, if, if you've ever seen that comic, that, that comic of, uh, of Red from Pokemon, uh, getting Giovanni with a D's Nuts joke, that's me. I did that one. Did you? Yeah, I did that one. Nice. Yeah, it, it's on my Tumblr, you can go check it out anytime. I'm gonna look for it after stream. Yeah. Alright, we're setting up a raid. We're setting up a raid. We're finding us out of our misery. This is an exclamation point. It's, is it back slash raid? I forget every time. We're raiding Bonnie! She's playing Minecraft! Yay! She's playing Minecraft and she's super cool and everybody's gonna like her or else. Yay, oh my god. Do you think it's a little less chaotic over there than it is here? Uh, yeah. Cool. Body streams don't tend to have chaos unless there's technical difficulties. <laughs> Watch us get there and the whole thing catches on fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You could spin brown dick. I'm so that sorry, Body, for what I'm about to inflict upon you. <laughs> yeah, we we've learned that Pow and I cannot be in the same stream together. No, I think it should be encouraged that we be in the same vicinity very <laughs> often. Go, go, Alright, we're running out of time, I gotta get my outro. Everybody, thank you for coming. Take your meds, drink water. Bye! Oh, Bye. Uh, uh, it's gonna get a snack, do your stretches. Uh, 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 Don't forget, concrete is not edible. Unless you're really brave. <laughs> <laughs> I love you all. Hail Satan. Dog dog. Good night, dog dog. <laughs>